merciful and compassionate, Ogidi. Take away sickness from our land. Give us good health. Bountiful harvest. Make us fruitful. I will dance for you. Because it's only the dance of a true priestess that gladdens your heart. My mother. Why, your mother? What's going on here? And what are you two idiots staring at? I am sure they are not the only ones who were attracted by your last squabble this morning. So can any one of you tell me what is going on? He's your father. Oh, you want to tell him? Have you no shame? I don't care! I do not care! I've long swallowed every jot of shame in me! Uche. I must tell you this before things get out of hand. Go ahead and spill out the nonsense you have in your mouth and see who takes the blame. Father, please let us speak. Son, for several weeks now, your father has refused to touch me. I mean, he seldom discusses with me every night like most normal husband and wife would do. I'm glad you said normal. Because you've given me reason to believe that everything between a husband and a nagging wife is abnormal. Son, your mother enjoys antagonizing me. She's the most nagging woman on planet Earth. Did you hear that? Did you hear your father? Instead of him accepting his wrongs, he's busy trading words with me. Father, son, your mother's attitude has gone beyond bounds. And may the gods help me. I will do what? You will do what? Beat me? You get me fair? Oh, can, can both of you stop this nonsense and listen to me? Okay. What has come over both of you? Why wash your dirty linen in public? If a king and a queen cannot settle their issues amicably without inviting a third party, they tell me, tell me how could they possibly settle cases that involve their subjects? Son, I have no issues with your mother. She just likes hearing her own voice and giving trivial matters undeserved prominence. I've been married to your mother for 25 years and I've been sleeping with her all that time. Simply because recently I have stopped doing it momentarily now. She wants the whole village to hear about it. Oh, you called several weeks recently? Mother, calm down. Calm down, please. It's walking away. Can you see that? M mother, if we get, mother, I say come. And if we fall on apple. Calm down. Calm down. You, you don't need to voice your marital issues to the hearing of the villagers. Okay? Who saw this out? Uchenna. Uchenna. Talk to your father. Gwalomun Nayoku. I am a human being with feelings. And he's still my husband. So he should. Treat me nicely as a wife. It's okay. One Nayo is okay. As you know, Ushi, as you know, Obako, as you know, Iko, as you know, Ekwara, oh, as you know, Ushi, as you know, Obako.
Chị Mộ Mâm Mâm Amarachi 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 Same as the one you told me. This is the fourth time, the fourth time in three days that I'm, I'm having this dream. Is it the same as the one you told me before? Yes. But this time around, it, it, it's more scary. I saw people die. It's as if the world is coming to an end. Mama, you know the world cannot come to an end. You know that. But I hope you can imagine all these things. All is not well. Maybe I'm just sick. Is that exactly my like fault? I think I should go to Mars with a list and get some medicine for you. Please, please do, my daughter, because the dreams are getting too frequent. Hey, I know mean, frequent dreams are signs of Iba. So I, I, I do believe you get better after taking the medicine. Um, let me hurry up and, and go to Mars's house. Because okay. Jebe, Jebe, oh, ma'am. Calm down. Oh, oh ma'am. Calm down. Jebe, Jebe. Prince, you don't look happy at all. What is the problem? It's inconsequential, is it now? Mm -mm. That's not my prince. You know, is it now will always do anything to put those smiles on your face. Okay, maybe I'll crack a joke. Yes, a joke, my prince. Right? As in, I'm not in the mood. Oh, this is really bad. I've not seen you in this mood before. What is the problem? You look so worried. I woke up this morning. I woke up this morning to meet my parents quarreling over issues that should be heard of a king or his wife. Oh, what kind of issues? Marital issues, as in that. Marital issues that shouldn't consign anybody, yet they make it public. If I hadn't intervened, they would have drawn a lot of attention. Oh, that's that's quite bad, my prince. But I don't need to get I don't I don't want you to get angry over it. Okay? Don't worry. I believe they will settle. You won't understand this now. You need to see the way my mother was lamenting. I've never seen them in this manner. I just pray they settle their differences before the council of elders intervene. They will, my prince. Okay? No, you stay back. I don't need you. Huh? All right, and where are you going with all the guys? My business.
a lovely dance. Well executed. I bet the goddess must really enjoy seeing how you twist your lovely waist. I wish I could relocate my palace to the shrine. <laughs> your Highness, be careful what you wish for. Because proximity can make or mar our relationship. You're right, my priestess. Maybe for now, the distance is preferable. But you know, the quest to be in the arms of the woman you love can make a man to act and speak without thinking. <laughs> my king, I missed you so much. The night was cold without you. Did you have a piece of me on your thigh? That I was... thought it should keep you warm at night. Your Highness, that was just a piece of cloth. Hmm? Look, having you in my arms all night is all that I crave for. Is it a safe time for us? Mm. You're afraid someone might walk into us. Don't worry. I will see whatever before we get here. Uh, <sighs> I remember. Mm. I love you so much, Priestess. <laughs> now let me make up for the cold nights. <laughs> <laughs> We have a great king. Mother. And a beautiful queen beside me. Because of the issues you had with my father this morning. General. Like I told you, your father has changed. He is not the same husband that I married. Oh. Come on. He's still your husband. I understand his strange behavior towards you lately. But you have to understand that he's a king. A king that is saddled with a lot of responsibilities. Maybe, or maybe he's just trying to deal with an appalling situation. What sort of situation is that? That will hinder a king's closeness to his wife. Once he retires to bed, he sleeps off. Early in the morning, gets out of bed without saying a word to me. Is that fair? Is that? No, no, mother. It's not all right. It's not. It's not good. I think I need to talk to father. Where is he? He left. To He's where? Father, be That's one of the things I've been complaining about. If we get. Oh, I understand. It's okay. Mother, just calm down, okay? I will talk to him. Hmm? Now, you don't have to wear this face. You, you need to smile like the queen that you are. What you happen? Oh, come on, mom. Don't do that. Happen. Come on, give me that smile now. Hey! <laughs> Mama. Mama. Amarachi. Mama. Mama. What is it? This one you're hurrying and shouting my name. What is it? Mama. What? He will not believe what I just saw. What did you just see? <laughs> that is making him run and shout. I saw. I saw the Igwe and the priestess at the shrine. Amarachi. What is wrong with seeing the Igwe and the priestess at the shrine? Maybe he had gone there for consultation. Mama. I saw them kissing. Baby, Mama, Baby, Yente. Don't ever use your mouth to blaspheme. But Mama, I'm serious. I saw them. I saw them with my eyes. Shut up! Don't say things you don't know, things you cannot explain. But, but Mama... No, don't butt me! No, I'm a child. Don't butt me! Don't let the priestess inflict you with madness. Get up, Miss Ego. Where's the medicine I sent for? Where is it? I knew you were Go and get me water to take this thing. Mm. I'll seek you later. Oh, yeah. 
Yes, but I still stand my ground that you have to improve on your fishing skills if not, no fish for you. Um, greetings, my prince. Greetings. Shh. Um, my prince, I, I, I went to look for you at the palace and I was told you were here. Why are you looking for me? Well, you can see, as you can see, I'm fine now. Okay. Stop it. I'm not done, my prince. Um, you know I love you so much. Please. Now get out. My prince. Get out! Way of discharging a distraction. Biabia Bianchiro, did you just call me a distraction? Would you want him? I never knew distraction is somebody's name. My dear. Distraction. Distraction. Have you heard that name before? Are you actually sure you heard somebody talking? Or sure. maybe it's the movement of some No, give me thunder, strike your mouth. Oh, man, what you are tear your intestine and destroy your mouth. Use hair. Mom! How? It's yours. Where? You see both of you, eh? You must regret this in this kingdom. Okay. Just watch and see. Okay. 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 some business. You're welcome back. Good. Have you been waiting for long? Not quite long, my king. But the queen has been so hospitable to us. All right, yes. all right, all right. Yes. Now to the business of the day. Uh, my king, we have contacted the youth leaders as you requested. All right. Yes. As you all know, the award of festival is just a few weeks away and we have to be fully prepared. I need the youth to take care of the wrestlers and the dancers while the elders will take care of the masquerade. Igwe. This award of festival has to be like never before. Something the entire kingdom will keep remembering from ages to ages. Igwe. Whoever is responsible for your sorrow and sadness, may he meet. Father, it's, it's the prince. The prince? Yes. What happened? Just because, just because I, I stopped to greet him. He, he answered me in a very rude manner, and when I tried speaking to him, he left with his friend. Oh, I am sorry. Hmm? I'm sorry, my dear. But have we not had this discussion before? Father, today's own is different. You need to have seen how rude he was with his response. And those stupid idiots were there. Ujun and Kiru, they were there mocking and laughing at me. Sorry about that. Huh? But uh, we agree that 
you know, you forget about the prince now that he's engaged to another woman. Father, it's him I want. I want the prince. Look, my dear, give another man a chance. I came home for you to comfort me. Instead of doing that, you chose to aggravate my anger. No, 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 come, 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 come. No, okay, don't worry. I'm late for a meeting, eh? I'll see you when I come back. Um, eh? Papa, where are you going? Ah, so where have you been? I've been looking for you. Uh, look, uh, go back and take care of your sister, eh? Okay. I am late for a meeting with the Igwe. I will see you when I come back. Okay, Papa. Sacrifice does not die prematurely, it will eventually germinate. Yes, yes my king. I believe that even though we are facing hard times, things will eventually get better. So we have to make do with what we have right now, and I believe if we do that, the gods in their generosity will bless us through that festival. He said... Oh, my king, please, uh, pardon my lateness. <laughs> Odunze, before you sit down, please call the town crier. Hmm? Oh, that? It is done. <laughs> <laughs> Odunze, I wonder when he will ever attend a meeting on time. The day Odunze attends a meeting on time, Know then that the cock has grown teeth. Lady <laughs> 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 Cox, my prince, you scared me. I'm sorry. My heart almost jumped into I'm my so, stomach. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay. Come on, just calm down. I have been waiting for you here for a very long time. How do you know I was going to take this way? Oh, uh, your mother. Your mother told me you went to see your grandmother. And I know you passed through this part. Sorry. <laughs> Are you okay now? Yeah, I'm fine. I have missed you so much. I've missed you too. I've missed you too, my friend. <sighs> you look so tired. How have you been? I've been okay. I've been fine. I couldn't sleep last night. I was thinking all about you. Then I should take responsibility for making you look dull this morning. Oh, way. not at all. I have been to the stream this morning. As a matter of fact, I am okay. But you know what? I feel much better with you in my arms right now. <laughs> You've only <sighs> had nice things to say to me. If I don't have nice words for my lady, tell me, who will I have it for? Hmm? I am ready to become a talkative for you, if that will make you happy. Just keep being yourself, that's all I need. I miss you so much. I miss you too.
hope it's not about your mother. She is your wife. And her well-being is my concern. For days she's been sad because of your strange attitude towards her. This morning you almost fought with her. Why, father? I have always known you to be a noble man. Principled. And a peacemaker. Why are you finding it difficult settling with my mother? Your wife? Look. I don't see why my bedroom misunderstanding with your mother should be an issue. It is an issue, father. It is an issue because you are her husband. And it is your duty to keep her satisfied. For 25 years, I have been satisfying your mother. So why is she not being reasonable now? Father, I am not in the position to tell you how to handle your wife. Good. Because you are still too young to understand the intricacies of marriage. Look. Tell your mother to stop nagging like a child. She's too old to be whining all the time. Please get me some palm wine. I want to drink something. <laughs> You know, I will give everything to see that you are happy. For quite some time now, you've been trying so very hard to get the attention of the prince. But all your efforts have been futile. I have even spoken to prince on several occasions, but his attention is on Ngozi. Is that a Kwensu girl that is standing between the prince and I? Father, you have to do something. You have to do something. What do you want me to do? I have spoken to, the, to her mother, but each time she ends up insulting me. But I understand with her because it's absurd for me to... It's the her. prince I want. I want the prince, Papa. My dear girl, try to allow another man a chance in your life. Don't forget about the prince. I will do no such thing. If you love and care for me as a daughter, do what is necessary for me to get the prince. To her severally about this. I wish somebody can convince her that the prince will never pick interest in her. You sound so sure. You sound so certain. I am a seer, or have you forgotten, Papa? The prince's heart is entwined with his lover, and there is nothing Olama can do about it. It's sad, I know, but it's the truth. She has to go and get another man. Eh? You have really learned how to cook on salad soup. Oh? <laughs> it was very tasty. Thank you, Mama. Next time, add more pepper for me. Okay. Eh? Yes, I will, Mama. Eh. Yes. By the way, Amarachi, have you planted the corn seeds? Uh, yes, yes, Mama. I have. I did. Mama. Mama. Yes. I came to tell you that I want to go out and play with my friends. Amarachi, don't you ever rest? Eh? After cooking, you fed me. After feed, you've not even eaten your own food. But now you want to go and play with your uh, friends. But I'm not hungry yet now. I'm not hungry. When see, when I get back, I'll eat. Okay. Okay. Go and play with your friends. Mama, watch your step. Oh. I'm so bad, bro. My, my stick is here. Mm -hmm. Amarachi, mm -hmm. be careful. Yes, Mama. Where are you? Watch it. Ami, why you? Why you? Inugo! Oh, Male Cham. Hey! Open. Hey. Akuvuko. Hmm. Yes, so. Words cannot express the joy that engulfs my heart. Anytime I think of you, I'll love you to death. I love you too, my prince. Eh? You're the kindest man I've ever known. Your parents are indeed favored by the gods to have you as their son. 
pooping. Talking about my parents, things have not been working out amongst them recently. You didn't tell me what happened. By now, we should be talking about how we'll come and see your parents to finalize our marriage plans. But with the way they are behaving, I mean, I am tired. You can't be tired. Don't say that. Eh? I believe they will sort out their differences. But you'll have to keep talking to them the way you're talking to them now. Hmm? I wish my father would just return back to his senses. The way they quote, they quote every now and then. It's all right, my love. I believe we will overcome this situation and the gods will indeed restore peace to your home again. I hope so. I know so. <laughs> Thank you for being there for me. Alanki, how are you this beautiful morning? I'm fine. Wow. As if you know I dreamt of you last night and I saw you sleeping in my arms. Mm -hmm. Dreams, you know, they say come true and I believe mine is about to come true today. Please, I would like you to help me out. I am interested in the prince and I am sure you are capable of convincing him to look my way. Hola, don't tell me you approached me this morning just, just to make, break my heart. The prince is engaged to Ngozi and he will end up marrying her, that I'm sure of. Nick, why don't you give me a chance? I don't Come. love you. It's the prince I'm interested in. Mama. The prince is not ready to consider any other lady apart from Ngozi. My love for you is genuine. I swear it. Are you saying you can't help me out? How can you ask me to leave you? I said I love you. Very much. Let me repeat myself. I don't love you. I don't have any feeling for you. If you're not willing to convince the prince to look my way, I would do it my way. Stay away from me. What you seek is just impossible. I'm the only friend the prince has, and I know, I know, I know what he wants. No, I don't know what this stupid girl says. What can you do? Focus, you see. You've been avoiding me lately. I'm sorry, my dear. I have been having issues with the queen. Yeah. She just started nagging recently and suspecting all my movements. Uh, so, whatever I do, I have to tread with caution. Do you think she knows something about us? Um, I don't think so. It's just that she's uh, jealous and unhappy because I hardly touch her these days. You know, no one can give me the kind of satisfaction I get from you. about our discussion. What have you decided? What discussion? Please remind me. Your Highness, I told you I want to quit this priesthood thing that has been hindering me from being with the man I love. But you just can't quit like that, priestess. The kingdom cannot exist without a priestess. <laughs> That was why I said I will name a successor before I leave. All I need is your support and permission. I don't know. Um, I have given it careful thought. If we take such an action, it might anger the goddess. Mm -hmm. So you prefer what we do here? 
May I remind you, Your Highness, no priestess is allowed to be with any man. Of course, of course, and I really do appreciate the way you've kept it away from the prying eyes of the goddess. But we must be very sure of whatever action we are taking. Hmm? All right? What is it? Someone is here. Someone is here. We must do something. We must do it now. Uh, please don't go. Um, sit down, let's enjoy this together. I'm not in the mood. Oh, please. We mustn't quarrel all the time. At least, let us enjoy these granuts together as husband and wife. Igwe, so now you know that I'm your wife. I've had a lot of things on my mind to deal with and I'm sorry it has affected our relationship. Even but what is that thing that's been bothering you that you can't share with your wife? When did we start keeping secrets? I thought it was something I could handle but I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry it has affected our relationship. See, as a king, I don't believe there's anything I can't handle. But I've been having these dreams recently and in that dream it was as if I was held captive in my own kingdom. There was, there was nothing I could do about it. It's just a dream. No, no, no. It's, it's, it's not. It's, I, I, I'm very sure something bad is about to happen. Greetings. Greetings, great priestess of Ogini. What has summoned the cricket out of its hole? Issues. Issues, your highness. A great calamity is about to befall this land. King to come with you and your daughter. I, I hope all is well. You will be told when we we'll get to the palace. Hey, Papa, no more. Why are Why are you coming? Why are you coming? Why are you My stick, Amara. Amara, my stick. Let's go. Amara, I need to hold my daughter. Her 
slaughter will bring calamity to this land. I ask again, priestess, what calamity are you talking about? Your Highness, I saw a vision of this woman and her daughter with the help of a sorcerer trying to steal the sacred mask of Fudgidi. No, Igwe. Igwe is not true. Igwe, it can never happen. I can never steal the mask. Igwe, I can't jeopardize the lives of our people. My people, I mean this kingdom. Igwe, I would never do that. With her in this kingdom, danger looms. She must be banished alongside with her daughter immediately. No! No, you will do no such thing to my mother. I know why you are doing this. Shut up! No. I don't know how you two are planning to do this. But I will not be alive and watch you two steal the sacred mask of Okidi. I will not be alive and watch you bring perpetual darkness to this kingdom. No! So many chameleons in the land. Look at this helpless, poor, blind widow. Instead of her to think of praying for the kingdom to prosper so that she will keep getting help from the palace. She has resorted to planning evil. The darkening of the cloud is a sign to the deaf. While the rumbling of the cloud is a sign to the blind that the rains are coming. Your Highness, be wise and do what you should do. No, no, you will be. You will be. I can't move the water. My hands are clean, Igwe. I am planning no such thing, Igwe Biko. As a one, as a one, you know, as a great man, as a one, you know me. I cannot repay your goodness with people. As a one, please. Please, on our behalf, as a one, because you are never on your soul. I'm nobody, please. I am blind. You heard what the priestess said. Whether or not you know such an intention in your heart, I cannot jeopardize the lives of my people. You and your daughter are hereby banished from the land. So this is really a bad deal, very bad. So upon everything that we did, we couldn't even achieve anything today. <laughs> My dear, it is very, very strange. This business is not as lucrative as it was. Uh -uh. See the priestess now. What was she even dancing? We danced very well. I know I can dance more than that girl. She just attracting unnecessary attention. On one wall. Be comparing yourself to the priestess of Wikidi. Mm. Don't you know she's the only one that can dance the goddess into answering prayers and, and performing wonders? That one is your business. So me, I know I can dance more than the priestess. I know. She unnecessary attentions now. What she, was she dancing? My dear, she can dance. Mm. Say the truth. She can dance. Forget mm. it. She can dance. She can dance See, more than you. She can dance more than you too. Mm. She dances very well and it takes a lot of energy to do that. Be comparing yourself to her and watch your mouth grow as large she as that of the crocodile. She can dance more than you. She can dance more than you, not me. She can dance more than you. You. She can dance more than you. She can dance more than you. It is you. No, you. <laughs> it's obvious you pigs don't have something meaningful to do with your time rather than sit here and gossip with my precious name hey, hey, hey. i have suffered hey precious name i have really suffered though so upon all of the villagers in this village it is you <laughs> that we will be gossiping how <laughs> well, wait did you just call me a moron no uh -uh. no 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 i don't like you want our lap because uh, why? Why will you call her a moron? Have you forgotten? She has made her more force from me, moron to an imbecile. <laughs> You call me an investor. Yes, you call me an investor. You call me an investor. You call me an investor. My prince, thank you so much for the fish. I like it. <laughs> You're welcome, Ezena. Thank you. But I will soon stop giving you fish if you don't improve on your fishing skills. Ah, Prince, yeah, I've improved now. <laughs> I've improved. I think it's the, it's the hook. It's the hook that is spoiled. Mm. It's no good. Mm. It's the hook. Uh, uh, the hook is bad. Yes, 
Ewe kusi ro. Ezenna. Prince. Have you forgotten that is that same hook that you condemned that I am using? Eh? You better improve on your fishing skills, else I will stop giving you fish. No problem, my prince. I will improve. I will improve. Eh? <laughs> my princess. Yeah? There is something I've been meaning to tell you. Mm hmm. What is it? Um, this girl, what's her name? Olama. She has been disturbing me about you. How? Eh, eh, she say she has to help her and talk to you. You know that uh, you should please look away. Eh, maybe Maria. Ezina, <laughs> <laughs> my prince. I am sure you know that is absolutely impossible. Oh. Because there is no way. I can never and I will not live in Gozi for any other woman in this world. Oh, my prince, I, this is a nice, sweet me. I like it. And I've been telling her, I've been telling the stupid girl she will not listen to me. Eh? She keeps giving herself false hope every time. Ah, I love that word you just used. Yes, false hope. <laughs> because I can imagine myself being with someone like her. Okay. Thank you, my prince. I like that. Found a place. Mm. How, how? How? What is it? It's a hot. How is it? Describe it for me. It's a hot under my glasses. My glasses. But it's not safe for you, my daughter. Why don't we go to the neighboring village? It should be safer than staying here. And that will mean crossing the Kisi River. And you know I cannot do that with you. Goddess of our land. Why? Why have you, you? Why don't you just take my life instead of allowing my daughter and I to just live in shame? Mama, you have started with your tears again. You will survive. And I can assure you that. But what if wild animals attack you? You, you know you're all I have in this world. I, I wouldn't want anything to happen to you. Listen to me. I'm Archie. Just go. Go to the neighboring village, go and save yourself. I, I, I will die here since that is what the priestess wants. Mama, nothing will happen to us. Goddess or no goddess, we will survive. We will live through this. And I'll always be here to protect you. Just stop it. My daughter, you talk with so much bravery. Just like your father before he died. I've heard you. Sit here. Sit. There's a seat? Yes. Sit okay, here. okay, okay. Let me, let me I just put it. Okay. employs um, laborers to come and weed this farm. Yes, Nne. But he stopped when he realized he could give it as punishment to offenders and fighters like us. Offenders? Fighters? Me? Offender? Fighter? Because of this idiot? These goats? You are seen now. You are seen. Papa, if not for this girl now, what would I be doing here now? If you even push her now, she doesn't even have strength to fight. She will just die. Yeah? It will also. Papa, the goats! Mama, the goats! Papa, you are the goats! You are the goats here, not me. Don't you ever in your useless life call me a goat. If not that the guards are here, I would have taught you a serious lesson. The lesson you couldn't teach me, where we almost removed that your polo eye. And your ear. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
no, 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 I thought you said the prince is your own. He belongs to you. Why don't you call him to help you out in this punishment? Try! <laughs> <Chai>! My dear, <laughs> why not call that your, your cripple brother? Your cripple. Come help you with the farm. Did you just call him by the cripple? Did you just call him? I can see you girls are stupid. Instead of you to walk, you want to create more punishment for yourselves. Yeah. God, talk to her. She should not insult any of my family members again. Me me Out what? Which of the family? Hey, 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 hey. Stop talking and get back to work. Now move away, girl. You're laughing at yourself. Hold on. Is it because I'm keeping quiet? Hold on. Hey, yo, hey, yo, hey, yo. What is it? What is it? What happened? I, I heard you were engaged. You engaged in a physical combat with nobody. Uh -huh. It's not good now. I'm sorry about everything. Yeah? It's okay. Make sure to shut up your mouth. Let me hear what now. Get out of this place. Get out! I don't need yeah, you. Don't here. get walked off. I only came to help out. I don't like you. I don't want you to help me out! No, no, no. Look at it. Shut up and get out. Shut up. Get out. Out. Get out. 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 Get out of here. Before you start feeling like one one queen with your hunchback, you better follow your hunchback mate now. I'm telling you because I said opportunity comes but once. <laughs> Am I lying? Diala. Okay. 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 You cannot do anything. He may be empty dag and yeah, but he may be sure. Edina, don't you ever your miserable stick is smelling like cockroach to me again? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. It's alright, sister. Stop crying. You and I know that you were the first to attack them. How did you know? I can't read minds. Why don't you forget those girls and the prince and also? I am going to visit their parents now. now. Eh? Those those idiots have humiliated you long enough in this village. I can't I, I can't believe they laid their filthy hands on you. Eh? They humiliated me so much today. I've been waiting at the king's farm since morning. Look at my body. Oh, my body is pinning me. Oh, my God. Look at my daughter's skin. Eh? Look at eh? Look at the skin I've been preserving to remain radiant. Eh? Those idiots. Don't worry. Don't worry. I am going to deal with them. Eh? They want my voice to be heard in this village. And it must be heard. Papa, please, let's forget about them. Forget about who? The people that insulted and humiliated your sister said I should forget about it. But she was the first that attacked them. Shut up your mouth. Were you there? They were the first to stop and attack me. Don't worry. Let me go and come back. We'll talk about this more. Let me go and see them. Yeah, 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 Kenna. You have to really start minding your business. I don't care if you see the future or the past. The only thing I know is that they touched me first and they must be dealt with. Now, go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> Oh, in the land of Morocco, we have a great king and a beautiful queen beside him. Oh, oh, and we have the brilliant elders of the rock. Where's Father? I want to be with you. Way without the guards, mm -hmm. I'm glad you're beginning to observe things yourself. I told you your father has changed so much. If only, oh, maybe he's going to sort some things out. Mm -hmm. Sort some things out, things like what? Uche, stop being blind to reasoning. Eh? Your father left here since morning, so what is that thing he's trying to sort out? Mother. Without his guts. Mother, you worry a lot over little issues. Why? Oh. So I shouldn't worry about your father. Even when I suspect he's into something dangerous. Mbwana. I discussed with him. He told me it is not easy sitting on that stool of power. 
He told me he's been fighting against lots of forces. He said he's been worried about the safety of this kingdom. But I thought Ugochi and her daughter have been banished. So why is he still acting strange? What will make a king leave his palace without his guards? Eh? Don't worry, mother. Don't worry. I'll sort that out, okay? Okay. Oh. Would you have told the elders that you saw the Igwe sleeping with the priestess? Ha. Amarachi, they would never have believed you. Rather, we would have been stoned to death. But you believed me. You did believe me. At first, though, I did not believe you. But when I kept having those frequent nightmares, and I knew there was trouble in our kingdom, but the one that baffles me the most is how, how can Igwe Odinaka commit such a sacrilege with the priestess, knowing the consequences of what he's doing? You should have allowed me to tell the earth what I saw. Mm. You would have saved us from being banished. My daughter, the night before we were banished, I had a bad dream. I saw the priestess kill you. If you had said anything, the king would have ordered for your death. So, what should we do now? Somebody has to warn the elders of the, of the abomination the king is committing. Ankaraji, the goddess will do her work. Do not worry. There's nothing we can do now. Anything we say now, they will say, they've already labeled us traitors. So there's nothing we would say that they will accept. But don't worry. If there's one thing that I am sure of in this life, it is the fact that you will be a great child. I doubt, Mama. How am I going to be, as in, how am I supposed to be great? We are living in this place. I, I can no longer step foot to my own father's land. Tell Mama, how am I going to be anybody great? It is okay. The goddess will look out for you. Patience, my daughter. Patience. My dear, I'm sorry I haven't been here in a long time. I have been dealing with a lot of issues and the Queen is getting more suspicious by the day. Your Highness, you always have one excuse or the other to offer. I'm sorry, my dear. Look, it's high time you gave my proposal serious consideration. A new priestess cannot be named until the full moon. Between now and then, we have time on our hands to fix things. Hmm? Listen, as soon as you name a successor, I will marry you. <laughs> Your Highness, <laughs> you're the best. I can't wait to be in the abode of a man I know. So, what are we doing to do to you? The queen? Mm. She'll just be there as a the ceremonial queen. But the real queen is you. <laughs> Look, I'm not worried about her at all. It's just the elders that I'm worried about because they might object to it. Mm? They would do no such thing. Your Highness, if any of them tries to challenge you, eh, the person will not live to see the next day. All I need is just your assurance that you will marry me as soon as I renounce my position. You have my word. Hmm.
he came. Don't you think you've worked enough? I don't want your father to send the guards to come and fetch you. Why would he send the guards when he knows I'm helping the one I love? He might not want to see you stressed like this. Eh? Come and rest, then you can continue tomorrow. But you just told me your mother will not be happy with you if you don't finish work in the next three days. Yes, so. That woman, she's very strong. She has finished chilling our land close to uh, Eziowa. Hmm. And you share in her strength. But I cannot watch you labor so hard when I know I can help you. See, I am not leaving this place until I finish working. You've not eaten anything since morning. Why don't you take a break, then you'll continue later. <laughs> My strength does not come from food. It comes from the fact that I know you love me. But you need to put something in this belly of yours. <laughs> if you say so. <laughs> mm. Goddess, it was a mad dream. Uh, you, you're having a dream again. Yes. This time again, they're becoming too frequent. Amarachi, I'm afraid of what will befall Obako Kingdom. The kingdom is under a serious siege. People are dying. I don't know how they're going to solve this problem. Mama. Why do you still care so much about those people? They banished us. Amarachi, they are our people. Innocent men, women, children are dying because of the king's atrocities. Well, just like you said the other time, there is nothing we can do about it since we are no longer needed in the kingdom. We have to pray. We have to continue praying to the goddess so that she will send a solution. Our people can't die like that. Mama, I'm not, I'm, I don't think I'm interested in any prayers. Though. Since the people who called our brothers and our sisters supported the king in banishing us, it's not a problem. Let them deal with whatsoever that is to be for them. Me, I'm out. Archie, how can you talk like that? Mama, I cannot pray for people that hate us. Oh, don't say that, my daughter. You don't repay evil with evil. to go to your own farm and harvest your own corn. I'm also hand me over this basket of corn. No, my own corn. Because it will be in hand. You can go matching it. Give me my corn. Give me my corn. Give me my corn. No, I don't want to give me my corn. No, I don't want to give me my corn. I don't want to give me my corn. I don't want to give me my corn. My king, those piglets have no right to insult my daughter. But I was the one that punished them. Yes, uh, my king, if they were the ones that attacked my daughter, when, why was my daughter punished? I'm not happy about this. Oh, Odunze, you should not have attacked Obika and Ndidi. Well, I was angry. I had to make my voice heard. They should be warned to stay away from my Olama. But you didn't approach it the right way. You should have come to me first as your friend. And I would have known what to do. Well, like I said, I was angry. 
I was angry and uh, you shouldn't have punished my daughter where you know that I am your person. Did you expect me to punish the other girls and spare your daughter? That would have appeared unfair of me in the eyes of the people. Yes, my king, but the punishment was too severe. You, you practically made her walk under the scorching sun. When you know that I've been working tirelessly to preserve and nourish her skin for your son, the prince. <laughs> Don't say. My apologies, my friend. Look. Advise your daughter to stay away from those girls because they don't like her. As for my son, I'm still talking to him concerning your daughter and I believe he'll soon come around. <laughs> well, my king, I, I am relying on you, you know. <laughs> Odunze, you've been a very loyal friend. Mm -hmm. And if getting my son to marry your daughter is my way of appreciating you, then I certainly will do that. <laughs> Thank you very much, King. Uchenna. I am really disappointed in you. What future could you possibly see with the daughter of a pauper? Father, where a man finds love, there lies his future. I love Ungozi with all my heart. I wish you could just hear yourself. What is it you fancy in this girl? I'm beginning to suspect that her mother is using charms on you. Oh, no, father. No. No. Father, what I feel for her is genuine. And I'm happy with her. Look. Olamma is the most beautiful girl in this kingdom from a respectable home. She will take good care of you if you give her a chance. Olamma belongs to another man and not me. Father, you can't coerce me into loving her. I mean, love is a natural feeling. And if I don't have such feelings for her, it simply means we're incompatible. How can you tell that you're compatible or not when you've not even given her a chance? How? Okay, Father, I am not interested in her. Period. You wash your mouth thoroughly before speaking to the prince. I can perceive a foul odor. Maybe that's why. That's why he's not giving you the attention you seek. How dare you? Enough, Wala. How dare you? Are you stupid? How dare you? Enough, Wala. Enough, Wala. Enough, Wala. Give me a look. Give me a look. Stupid girl. This is just a warning. Stay away from my man. Stay away from the prince. Hey! Amarachi! What happened? Eh? You kept me worried, you know? What happened? I had a rough day. You had a rough day? Ogini me. Were you not able to harvest the corn again? I did, I did, but one boy took it away from me. 
On your boot the boy. Who is he? Is he being a boy? I, I don't know him. I think it's from the neighboring village. He just bullied me and took away the cone that I had harvested. Okay, ma'am. Wrap here, oh? Don't worry. Eh? At least he did not rape you. Neither did he beat you. Biko, Apoba. I'm not happy. If I were to be a boy now, would he have done that to me? Hi. Amarachi. Are you blaming the goddess for making you a woman? Don't let her hear that, oh. Don't worry. You know the goddess, she knows how to punish wicked people. Eh? Papa, oh god, what are you Don't worry, my daughter. The goddess knows how to pay wicked people back. Let go. I'm not happy at all. I'm not happy. You remember, the last corn you harvested, we still have some inside. All you have to do is bring it out and we'll roast it and eat it this evening. Don't worry, my daughter. Let go. If I had my sight, what I would have done for you, my daughter, I would help you to achieve a lot in this compound. Don't worry about that. As long as I have life in me, I feel for us. Amarachi. Amaramarama. Amarobini. Mama. Amarane menyona amuline pepa. Did you succeed? Yes, I did, my queen. I was able to follow him to the shrine of Ogidi. The shrine of Ogidi? What could he possibly be doing there? I did not go for that to check, my, my queen. The shrine of Ogidi. See, like I say, in this kingdom, we value our tradition and um, we value respect for our elders because we believe that when a young man respects his elders, he will grow into old age and the young ones will now in turn respect him. Yeah. Yeah. Come again, my prince, you are welcome here. Save your greetings. Where's your daughter? <laughs> my prince, don't be. Don't be too aggressive on your father-in-law. Eh? Don't be too aggressive on your father-in-law. Welcome. I am running out of patience, Ichi Odonze. Where is she? Oh, my prince, don't worry. We are happy to see you. I'm sure Olama herself will be happy to see you. Olama! <laughs> Olama! Hey, I'm the mood. Your husband is here. <laughs> my prince. <laughs> My prince, my prince, please, spare my sister, please. What is it? Don't want to treat me, lady. You want to kill her for me? Eh? No. Please. It's okay. It's okay, baby. It's okay. Were you hot? Now you listen to me. The next time you lay a finger on Ngozi, I'll kill you. It's not the way to treat a lady. Caution your daughter. Caution your daughter, Eche Odonze. I will kill her if she harasses my woman again. And warn her. Warn her to stay away from me. She won't be this lucky next time. <coughs> Did you fight in Gozi? Yes. But why? I thought we agreed that you're not going to fight anybody again because of Prince. Yes, but she insulted me. She called me names in, in front of some villagers. I had to fight her. Is that why the, the Prince would treat me like this? Because of that wretch? Sorry. Sorry. Sorry, go on, go on. Sister Ola, let the Prince go before he hurts you, please. Thanks for your concern. I love him. 
Nein, nein, sie ist hier, glaubst du? and beat me. Go ahead and beat me up. Let me see how the villagers are going to eulogize you for it. I am totally ashamed of you. I am ashamed of you. You've lost every trace of a true king in you. I will pretend I didn't hear that. You're playing with fire by challenging me in my own palace and kingdom. Whatever I choose to do with my life is not your business. I can go wherever I please. Why are you finding it difficult to answer my question? And I'm asking you the question again and again. What were you doing with the priestess in the shrine yesterday? I will not answer such a stupid question. Because mm -hmm. if you were not stupid and senseless, you would know that there's nothing wrong with a king visiting the priestess of his kingdom. Not when the king's visit to the shrine becomes too frequent. What are you insinuating? What business do you have with the priestess? Can you feel you again? Sad. What is the problem? Mm, Uche, I confronted your father this morning over a discovery I made yesterday. What discovery? I asked a guard to follow him to where he was going. And he was able to trace him to the shrine of Ogidi with the priestess. The priestess? Mm -hmm. Guinea Mesia. I don't think there's any problem with him visiting the priestess. Uche, you don't get it. It's not just yesterday. That's where he goes to all the time. No problem, Sonia. But mother, don't you think it has to do with the the frequent dreams he said he's been having lately? Dreams what? I think he has gone to see the priestess to seek spiritual solution. So look at And what solution could he be seeking for outside his throne? Okay, when do kings start seeking for solutions in a shrine with their priestesses when they can simply invite them over? What's the solution? Mother, what are you insinuating? Luce, if your father is into what I'm thinking, I'm afraid he will bring doom on all of us. You said you would come earlier. I'm sorry, my dear. I had a little argument with my nagging wife. Look, one of these days, very soon, 
I will publicly renounce her as my wife and have her thrown into the palace pit where she belongs. I can't wait for that day to come. Because I won't need her in the palace and I'll come there as your wife. It's just be you and I running the affairs of the people. And your son? My son is never going to be a problem. I'll just explain to him that right from the start, we had loved each other, but you had, we had to renounce our love because of your calling. But now that you have renounced your calling, that we're back together. Oh, you will protest. Look, all I care about is I have waited for so long and I can't wait any longer. We were meant to be together and we will surely be together. Damn the gods. Damn the gods? Prince must definitely marry you. So you see, you have nothing to worry about. But I have everything to worry about. He's not his son and he cannot make decisions for him. But he's the king. And his, his, his command stands. You know that uh, the king and I are in a very good relationship. And he, he values my friendship. You understand? He has given me his word. And um, he won't go back on it. I am sure of that. But you have to persuade him more. I can't afford to lose the prince for lose him to that stupid Ngozi. No, 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 no. You see, I promise you I was going to talk to the parents. All that a poor man needs is food on his table and uh, little coins in his pocket. And you know I got a lot to give, so they want their daughter to stay away from your man. Hmm? But I'll keep fighting whoever that challenges me. That won't be a good idea. That won't be a good idea, so that you don't get punished by the king all the time. Hmm? It looks as if it's going to rain. Hmm? I don't think it's a sign of your papa. Why are you so Something has happened to this land. Outcast and car. Mom, don't worry. All will be well. In you go. Mama, I hope you finished your food and took your medicine. I finished my food and I took my medicine. Mbobo ne now worry, Ari. Eh? I'm okay, thank you. Okay, I have to hurry and go to the forest to get some fire. I would use the last one this morning. Mbam bam bam. You just came back from the stream now. Why don't you rest before you start going to the forest? Mbobo ne now bali bulu 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 koke. Mama, you know that the forest is no longer far from where we are living. Let me just grab fresh firewood. I'll be back. Well, okay, at least eat your food before you go. I'm not hungry yet. When I come back, I'll eat. Let me just go now. Amara Chifi, I, I, I don't like it. Uh, uh, I don't like it. Too much. Let me just go. How do Goddess of our ancestors, Biko, just take care of this child for me. She can't keep suffering like this now. Oh, now Oh, now I'm going to go. Biko. But be careful, oh. Put up one scene, sir. Hi. 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 Hi.
What? What is the problem? It's your father. He's not yet back since morning. Have the guards checked the shrine? The shrine? What would you be doing at the shrine with all the thunderstorm we witnessed today? Guards! Guards! My brain. Go to the shrine and check if the king is there. Fast! All right, my brain. I still cannot believe that Odnaga could do this to us. I still cannot believe that Odnaga could jeopardize the, the future of this kingdom. Hello, Kacha, hello. Hey! We are doomed. My people, we are doomed. How can the priestess of a land allow herself to be defiled by a man in the swine? Not just a man. But the king, uh, Odeneka, look at how you betrayed us, your people, and left us at the verge of extinction. Hey! And who would believe that our king will do this to us? We are finished. My queen, we are finished. Hey! Come, my queen. Are you, are you telling us that you never suspected anything all this while? I did. I suspected. Remember what I told you the no. I didn't understand the man I was married to. I confronted him. He threatened me. My son here, we bear me witness. I spoke to my father concerning his strange behavior. But he told me that he has been having series of dreams about the future of our land. He told me there are lots of enemies surrounding the kingdom. But all that was a lie. He was actually the enemy of the kingdom. Who knows how long they have been into this. For the goddess to have gotten so infuriated. And now we are the ones paying for their sins. Many people have died. Many more are going to die. So you were this wicked. You didn't even tell me, your friend. You didn't even tell your Ono how wicked. So you were deceiving us all this while. Well, we have to go home now and see how we can save our families. Okay? That's 
Thank you, my elders. Thank you very much. Stop crying. Stop crying. The gods move better. Hola, my relax. Nothing will happen to him. How could you possibly know with all the things that's been happening? The kingdom is in serious danger. I know, but he will be back. Papa, you got us sick with worry. Where have you been? I went to the palace to see the Igwe. I just discovered that Igwe has committed the worst atrocity. What did he do? The Igwe has been having an affair with the priestess. And the goddess got angry and smit both of them. And the Ugidi's rage cannot be pacified. Not when the shrine has been defiled. What are we going to do now? My dear, you will take your brother. Both of you will leave this kingdom now. Save yourselves first. No way, Papa. I am not going anywhere. So am I. Not without the prince. Forget about the prince. I love him. Forget about the prince and save yourselves first. Papa, it's not wise for us to leave. We can never make it out of the kingdom. I need to be sure all is well with my love and her family. By risking your own life? Are you blind to see there have been pestilence going on in this life? And that's the reason I should go to make sure she's safe. I'm sure Ngozi and her family are fine. Oh no, mother. No, 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 you can't be too sure. Uche, be cool. So sorry, Kawuma. You are the only one I have left. Please, don't make me a childless widow. Just stay back. It's not good for you. It's not safe for you. Bikonu. Mother. Mother, please allow me to go. I need to be sure all is well with my love. Uche. Uche. Calamity to befall us. What have we done to deserve this? Hey! Or did I care it shall never be well with you? You are that evil princess, wherever both of you may be. It shall never be well with you. It will not be well with you, Adidaka. Use my life without the one I love. Ngozi is gone. Ngozi is gone forever. Why me? Mother, why me? Why? What have I done to the gods to deserve this? 
ask is okay. Oh, what are you for joining me? Hmm? You have done nothing wrong. Eh? I'm so sorry about what happened. I should have allowed you to go there on time. I'm so sorry. Don't do this to me. It's okay. It's okay. Don't do this to me. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You're back. Mm. Uh -huh. Mama, you will not believe what I heard this afternoon. What did you hear? Serious calamity has befallen the people of Abaco Kingdom. What kind of calamity? I don't know what they say the king did, but a serious plague has befallen the people. A lot are already dead. Though. That explains the frequent dreams I've been having. If people are already dying, that means if my dream comes to pass, nobody will survive in Abaco Kingdom. So what, so what do we do now? We have to keep praying. We just have to keep praying. The king brought this calamity on our people. Because of what you saw him and the priestess doing. They were committing serious abomination when I saw them. Now, now innocent people are going to be punished for what they did not do. But what exactly did you see them doing? Hmm. Yeah, you, also. You, you again, what do you want? Of course you know what I want. Why can't you go to the farm like every other young man do and get whatever you want for yourself? Stop shouting and give me that call. I'll shout oh, I'll shout because I don't know what I've done to you to deserve this treatment. What is it? Leave me alone. All I need is the call. I don't want any trouble with you. This one is for me and my blind mother. If, if I give it to you now, what are we going to eat? Your mother is even blind. Talk time is over. Yeah, no more can. My prince, you have to pull yourself together. Okay. I know it's very hard for you, but what has happened has happened. It's a pity nobody could have changed anything. Okay? This is man. If I had gone there in time, I would have saved the life of the only woman who made me smile. But you didn't. Faith has taken its course. I gave Faith the chance to play its part. And I blame the goddess for treating me this unfairly. And as for my father, if I had met him alive, I would have struggled him myself for causing me pains. No, 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 my prince. Take it easy on yourself, okay? Say no more. Just take it easy. Oh, how sad and lonely my life has become. My prince. You are not lonely. My brother, you still have me and your mother. Okay? I believe the gods would send you a good woman someday. One who will love and appreciate you. Just like I do. Just like I do, my prince. Olama, bam, bam, bam. This is the wrong time for you to visit the prince. What do you want? My prince, I heard what happened. I am here to sympathize with you. It's, it's very bad that, that the whole family wiped off just like that. Who doesn't know Ngozi in this village as a nice girl? She's such a good girl. I'm so, I'm so, I'm so, uh, I'm so sorry, my prince. Thank you. My prince, it would be f better if you give yourself the chance to love again. And I love you so much. I love you with all my heart and I can do anything to make you... Stop it! And get out of here. Leave! 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 No! 
Now, Pukodi. Please, please, calm down. She's just a distraction. I don't know what this girl is all this. Listen, then. Don't ever want to see her here again. You won't see her. Please, just let her. You won't see her. Just calm down. Fear. Afoji, are you seeing what I am seeing? All our farmlands are drying up. I was even told that even our stream has dried up. What is this kingdom turning into? Hey! Oh no. No food. No water. Are we going to fold our arms and watch our families perish? I, I don't know. I don't know. That reminds me. Have you gone to see uh, Obika? No, but I heard what happened to the wife and the son. It is really a pity. Hey! I don't know if we can survive this. I, I just pray that God has will save us. Because I have never seen or heard anything like this in my entire life. I have not. Hey! But of what, you know what? Whatever it is, I would be the last person to run away from my father's life. I will not. So Jimmy, my friend is gone. <laughs> With my son, Chukoma. <sighs> so sorry. <laughs> Pull yourself together. What kind of calamity is this? God has suffered a lamb. Why? Why pass your anger upon us? Nai. What have we done to deserve this? Nai, pull yourself together. Why? If you cry like this, what will your daughter do? It's okay. <laughs> Did she tell you what she was No, Papa, she did not. How could she be so stupid not to tell you where she was going to? Huh? When she knows the, the perilous times we are in. But you should have stopped her as the, as the man of the house. Papa, I asked her not to step out, but she refused. How can I stop her when I can't even get up? Let's keep waiting for her. I believe she will soon be back. Yeah. Yeah. Hola, ma. Sit down here. Where are you coming from? I went to see the prince. You went to see the prince where you know the perilous times we're in. Or didn't you hear what happened to Ngozi and her family? I heard. That's why I went to commiserate with him and see if he can look my side. But he chased me out of the palace. Well, you shouldn't have risked your life going there in the first place. You know he is still mourning her loss. Huh? And you didn't discuss anything with me. You just left. I'm sorry. Don't risk your life like that next time. Oh. Uh, don't. Uh, um, I've heard you. Go on. Uh, welcome. Go and get my snuff. Do you know that the, the prince chased me out of the palace? I don't understand. <laughs> Please come and rest a while, then you can continue later. Let me just finish up and take my bath. Ichi Obika, 
Please, I'm so sorry about the sad incident that occurred in, in your home. Accept my condolences. There's no need to apologize for your highness. You, you, you don't have to be sorry. Eh? Your wicked late husband brought this destruction upon me. Eh? He ruined my family. Mazobika, will you lie? Will you lie, Makagili? It's okay. What is okay? okay. Take it easy. For what? Of course, you know that the queen has no hand in this. Neither does her son. Yes, we have the goddess to blame for venting their angers unjustly on us. So, they were infuriated by the our late senseless king. Oh, oh. You understand? Who took actions without minding the consequences? Okay, last time we eh? Take it easy. Ichi Obika has a right to be angry. And let us not forget our brothers and sisters who lost their lives in this disaster. And many will still die. My elders. I believe we are here to find a solution and not to apportion blames. That is true, my prince. We, the kingmakers, have been putting our heads together over this, and we have decided to crown you our next king. Maybe it will be the way out for us. Yes, my dear. You see, we felt that uh, the goddess is angry with us because of the vacancy that exists on the throne. Hence our decision. I don't think that's the wise thing for us to do now. My queen, yes. you must have a reason for saying this. Please, can you let us know? My elders, I think we should get someone who can communicate with the goddess. I mean, we should tell her how sorry we are. Pacify her with our sacrifices. Maybe he will finally get to talk to us. Biko. My queen, your wisdom amaze even the goddess. I think you are right. Crowning the prince may not be the sure way to pacify the goddess. I think we need to see someone who sees beyond the ordinary and communes with the goddess. Do you have Azumba. anyone in mind? <laughs> the goddess is so angry because her sacred abode was defied severally by the priestess who blindfolded her each time she committed the abomination with her lover. But you cannot cheat a deity. Not at all. Though I was able to calm her. Oh, thank you, wise one. But you have until the next full moon to present a successor who will take over the priesthood of the shrine. Next full moon? Yes. That, that, that is 14 days away from now. Hmm. Yes. And failure to do that, this kingdom will cease to exist. But be careful, Ogidi is a goddess who answers with rainfall that comes with healing and blessings. You must give her what she desires, and that is a maiden who can dance her way into her heart. Um, uh, in that case, we'll begin, we'll start organizing the, the maiden dancers. Uh, who are left in the land Uzbuz, immediately? Uzbuz, 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 uh, Uzbuz. Uh, uh, wise one, on behalf of the people of Obako Kingdom, I thank you so much. Akugum, all I'm mum. Hey, how are you this morning? What are you doing here? Hola. When will you ever be friendly with me? When will you ever learn to stop disturbing me? Ah. All I'm, I brought this for you. Hey! I don't care. I am not interested in your cheap unripe plantain. Take it out of this place and leave this house now! Hola. I love you with all my I don't love you! Is it too hard to understand? I don't love you! Leave! Please, understand me. I can give you anything you want in this life. Just love me. Wait, back. let me go. Papa! Papa! Shh! Why are you calling your friends? Oh, you're Papa! Oh, you Papa! Oh, you're Come on, my boy. Take it, take it. Take this your useless plantain and get out of this place. Oh, get out! Okay. Papa! Hey, wait. You should have just stayed and see what you do. Don't come to this house again. I've asked the town crier to pass the message of the goddess to the villagers. I pray that in the next 14 days we'll be able to have a priestess so that peace can return to this kingdom. Mother, I should have listened to you. 
I should have monitored father the moment you detected a change in his attitude. He lied to me. I know. But it's not your fault. His lies were more convincing. Yeah. But why did father change his attitude? Uche, uneasy lies the head that wears the crown. I want you to be careful in life so that you don't make the same mistakes your father made. Inugo? announced through the town crier. She said there will be a dancing competition amongst all the young girls that want to be the priestess of Ogidi. <laughs> Are you serious? That's good news. This is a golden opportunity for both of us. Mm -mm. Not for both of us, for you. I want you to win. But you know you can dance. Would you? Why are you talking like this? Why are you making my head swear? You're talking as if you cannot dance. You know you can dance. Mm. See, that oh, thing, See, I don't care. But one of us must win that competition. But really, we have to start practicing now. There's really no time more. Because the competition will be in the next full moon. It's... Yeah, it's... Mm -hmm. uh, we've not practiced anything yet. See, uh, I have to go home now. Where are you going now? I'm going. See, no, no, let's go. I think my father will be waiting to tell me. Then go. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll come to the house later. Come on! <laughs> you are joking, isn't it? What would you have told your father that a woman punched you to the ground? Isuzu Godu, your father would have disowned you. Ta! Ta! Would go happy, yeah. Happy good, yeah. This small girl. This small rat. That's the key. One name is Seba Poma, brother. One name is Seba Poma. What do you want? You think you can disgrace me and get away with it, Okuya? I'm, I'm sorry, it was a mistake. I didn't do it on purpose. Shut I... up! So you think you can disgrace my friend and go scot free? Eh? Honey, are you sure this is Oh, oh, you're not being I'm sorry, see, anytime I see you, I'll give you anything I have. I'm sorry. Da! Don't let her talk. Rush her! You!
are joking, isn't it? I'm serious, I'm serious. I'm very, very serious. What would you have told your father that a woman punched you to the ground? Isuzu go do. Your father would have disowned you. Ta! Ta! Which could happen, yeah. Happy good, yeah. This small girl. Yeah. This small rat. That's the one day, say about poor my friend. One day, say small girl. What, what do you want? You think you can disgrace me and get away with it, Okuya? I'm, I'm sorry, it was a mistake. I didn't do it on purpose. Shut up! So you think you can disgrace my friend and go scot free? Eh? Honey, I be sure this is Oh, oh you yeah, be here. I'm sorry, see anytime I see you, I will give you anything I have. I'm sorry. Da! Don't let her talk, rush her! You Amarachi, these are your strange powers. I don't understand them. Mama, for days now I've not been myself. I have not been myself. But why didn't you tell me when you started noticing all those things about you? I thought it would go away, but it keeps on manifesting. That day I was cutting firewood that I screamed. Mm -hmm. Actually, it cut my leg. Mm -hmm. All of a sudden, it just healed immediately. I and, and that day, you know, there was a boy I was telling that had been harassing me. Has he started harassing you again? Yes, so Mama. Eh? And this time around, him and his friend, they blocked me. I pleaded, but he refused. His friend wanted to beat me. All of a sudden, I slid him to the ground. Ha! Mama, how I did it, I don't know. Jalo, he went to one He went to one another. Oh, don't go cable. Oh, don't go cable. Don't mind the nonsense boy. Hmm? Hey, you know, eh, I've been having visions of you as a great woman. I know you will end up being very great and doing great things. But this power of fighting and beating up people, I never saw it coming. Mama, could it be that something is wrong with me? Is this a good sign? Let me ask you a question, my daughter. This power, this special power, maybe you're under pressure or when you're in pain. Mm, yes, yes, Mama. Yes. Oh, no, ma, what is wrong with you? Eh? Why don't you forget about this prince and face the brighter side of life? What's brighter side of life? Yes, forgetting about the prince and focusing on becoming the priestess of Ogidi. to ask yourself what will happen to the love I have for the prince. My dear, whatever love you think you have for the prince is wasted because it has never been reciprocated. Instead, he hates you. Are you saying there's nothing we can do? What haven't we done? What haven't we done to dissuade him from Ngozi and look your way? His father would have been the surest way of getting to him. But the old man is dead. So why don't you forget about him? But he's still single. He's not married yet. Yes, he will marry when he is ready. But not now. And I'm sure even if he decides tomorrow to get married, he won't stand any chance. Let us tell ourselves the truth. For once my opinion was considered. He is not for you. I need you to prepare for the competition that is coming up. I will give you every necessary support. You know you are my only daughter and I will do everything to support you. I will help you achieve you know, an enviable position in this kingdom. Eh? Think about it. When is the competition coming up? Mm, the next full moon, and that will be two market days from now. Yes. Very good. You know you have always been the best dancer among your peers. And I know you are going to clinch an enviable position. <laughs> yes, Mama. But, Mama, mm -hmm. in as much as I want to win, 
I want my friend in Kiru to win. Eh? Why are you saying such a thing? Mama. Mama, you know she has lost so much this period. And Kiru is a very nice girl. I want something that will console her, something that should make her happy. Haven't we lost someone? Your father died as a warrior of this land. Why are you saying a thing like that? I know your father will go we wish you become a great woman in this kingdom. You are the priestess. <laughs> well, that depends on how well I'm going to dance that day to make Okiti answer us with a rainfall. You are the priestess and I will do anything within my powers to make sure you get it. Mm. <sighs> Mama, you are so confident about this. How do you intend to achieve that? You are the priestess. I will do everything within my powers to make sure it works. Have you thought of picking a wife for yourself? Mother, hmm? that is very, very far from my mind right now. But I will. When? Hey, who go on there? When the time is right. Yes, when the time is right. But for now, I think I'm more concerned with the future of this land. I know. But soon, we'll have a priestess. And our future will be secured once again. Until then, mother. Please. I want you to give it a thought. No king can exist without a wife. I know what you've lost. But I'm sure wherever she is right now, she wants you to get someone that will make you happy. I understand, mother. And in no time I'll get one. But for now, I am not ready to give any woman a chance in my life. Just give me some time. Soon, very soon, the elders will call you for a meeting on this matter. It is very necessary. Biko, it is necessary. Okay. Oh? I am Amarachi, Amarachi, thank God you're back. Amarachi, Kelly, Kelly, Kelly. Amarachi, Amarachi, oh, Amarachi, thank you, thank you. Uh, what happened? Why, why is the place scattered? Amarachi, two boys, two boys came here. They were looking for you. They, when I tried to find out who they were and why they were here, they, they, they found out I was blind. Amarachi, Then, then they, they, they started scattering the whole place. On the land. They started scattering the whole place, Amarachi. They said that if they get you, eh, they will deal with you. So boy, yes. They arrest you. Yes. So these animals had the gods to come to this house and, and scatter it and touch you, Mama. They, they had the gods. Baba, Baba, Amarachi, and I Baba, Biko. Biko, I beg you, don't go anywhere. Just leave them, Biko, Amarachi, please. Please. Mama, eh? you, need to, you need to see how this place is looking. Do you know how long it took me to arrange this place? And they came here, they came here, scattered here, they, they, they touched you, Mama. I'm around my best name, my best name, my best name, it's okay, stop crying. The goddess of our land will deal with them. My best name, just tell me what to do, we will do it together, can't you? Let me help you, I'm like, oh, but you're crying now, I'm like, oh, no, but it's not fair. I'm like, oh, I'm like, 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 I'm Papa, welcome. Yes. Where is your sister? She's at the backyard. Backyard. Hola, ma. Papa. Fine, welcome. Papa, you're back. Yes. You're welcome. How are you? I'm fine. Um, this is uh, Nenna. I, I guess you know her. Yes, she's a very good dancer. She used to dance with Nkiru and Ujungwa. Yes, that's right. You see, I, I brought her to 
help you know in perfecting your dance step. Are you serious about this? Yes. It's been long I stopped dancing since I left to Jungwa and Kira. I've not danced. Yes, that's why I brought her so she would now coach you and make you, you know, better. Can she do that when she's contesting too? No, I am not interested in becoming a priestess. But Ujungwa and Kira are the best dancers we have in this kingdom. I know. But you were doing better than them when you were together. And I know you still have that spirit in you. All you need now is my coaching. Yes, my dear. Let her coach you, you know, so that you become the, the best dancer in this kingdom, so that you clinch this position for your family, for me, and for yourself. I don't want this. I am not interested. But for your sake, I'll give you the try. That's my daughter. That is my daughter speaking. Um, Nana. Please get to work. <laughs> Follow her. Let's go. Welcome. Are you eating? Yes. In the land of Obaku. We are still indigents of the land. We have a And now they are trying to do all they can to save the land from further pestilence by organizing a dancing competition for the goddess. Mom, I want you to be part of it. I should join them. I should join those wicked people and do what? Save their land. I'll be calling them all perish. Amarachi, don't say that. That is wicked. You have to remember that there are some innocent people still in that place. People that had nothing to do with our banishment. We can't sit back and allow them to, to perish. But I'm not a dancer. I only danced for you when your, when your sight was still there. Since you lost it, I lost interest. My daughter, at least you will help to save the land. Eh? We can't just sit back and let that land perish. At least let it be the only thing we can do for them. For posterity's sake, big one. Okay. What do we do about it? I, I've lost my dancing steps. That is not a problem. Your mother still remembers some of those dance steps. Do you want me to show you? <laughs> Mama, I'll, I'll, I'll show you. <laughs> Mama, Mama, stop. Uh, Mbamba, <laughs> I don't even need the stick. Wait, I'm, I'm thinking. Yeah. I remember one song. Be there where I be. Oh, Echo. 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 I don't need my sight to dance. Na ni ebule ibo ilinda na wa e ni wa mare so kuo. Igagam igam igagam igano wala kamari yamo aye ne me kamari yamo. Just tell me when I'm about to hit something. Igagam. Akoni si ne pe o na na o na. Just come. Nina. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? Chine Keme. Those girls are good. See their dancing steps. They have good dancers. They've perfected more in days. Even more than me. How oh, can no. I match up with them? All lie. You have nothing to worry about. Whatever dancing style you're seeing there, I can teach you. It's just that they have introduced a lot of styles. That is it now. Since they've introduced a lot of styles, why can't I learn all the styles? Let's just stay here and monitor them so that I can grab those new styles and then we'll teach you. Are you sure? Yes.
Mama. Are you sure of what you said you saw? <laughs> I know I am not blind and short of senses not to recognize Ichi Obika. I was surprised. But Mama, what were you doing at the powerful man's shrine? That man is dangerous. What were you doing there? I know. But I went there to make sure you become the priestess of this land. <laughs> oh, good. Mama. I don't understand you. You know I promised you I will be alive, see it come to pass. But I was shocked with what I saw today. I was shocked. And I know your friend never told you her father's intention of seeing her becoming the priestess mm. at all costs. Mama, Inkiru said her father never supposed her. <laughs> now you know she lies to you. She planned it out with her father. If I did not see Ichi Obika today, I wouldn't have believed this myself. Mm -mm. Mama, I don't believe you. I don't believe you. Her father never supports her. Mama, I am the closest person to Inkiru. If Inkiru plans that with her father, she will tell me. <laughs> but you are not the only one supporting her now. Mama, you know. That support was all she needed. She already told her father to secure the position for her. So whether you support her or not, she is short of winning. Hmm. What a word. But Mama, you haven't told me what you went there to do. I went there to secure a charm. To make sure you win this competition. But after seeing Obika there, I decided to consult a more powerful Dibia. Hmm. Now you know <laughs> that's uh, Nkir, your friend. She is not what you think she is. She's a chameleon. But I am not saying you should confront her. Just pretend and see if she will tell you that her father got her a charm. <laughs> Nkiru. Nkiru. Okay. Now, <laughs> now, you need to practice your dance steps. Eh? I'm even tired. I, I, I don't tell me that. You need to dance. You need to practice your dance steps. Mom, I'm tired. Mbao, you have to practice your dance steps. That's the only way you can win. How are you even sure I will win? I'm not sure. But you can only win by dancing and practicing. Eh? Biko, we never know the mind of the goddess. Eh? Biko, I, we are just mere mortals. We don't know what they would decide. We don't know what she will decide. So, Biko, just keep practicing. Mama, so if I win, will you really want me to become a priestess? Iheni, if it is your destiny, I will not object now. Eh? Don't you think life could be boring for a priestess? <laughs> not when she has the company of her mother. Okay, let us not start thinking of what life could become for a priestess. I'm not yet a priestess. There's no harm in looking into the future. Anyway, the goddess controls our lives. She decides on what we will become and how we will go through life. So, Mwam, continue practicing. And you take one one, you take double double. Yes, eh? One, one, double double. Then you go, you take one day, 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 you take one Is it now? What is it? What are you doing here? Hold on. Please reduce your voice. Have I not warned you to stop coming to this place? I heard you are participating in the dancing competition. Mm -hmm. Hold on. Why are you doing this to me now? If you become a priestess now, you know I can't have you. And, it, and it's not fair. Shut up and leave this house. Leave! Please, Olam, Bikun. 
You know I love you. From my heart, from the depth of my heart. Please. Olam, be gone. Look with pity on me. You don't want to leave. Don't worry, stay. Papa! Papa, look at this idiot. He has been disturbing me, begging me to become his girl. I told him that I'm not interested, but he wouldn't let me be. No, he's not. Will you shut up? She says she doesn't want you. Yes. She doesn't need you. Don't you understand? Let this be the last time I will see you anywhere around here or hear that you are speaking to her. If you do that, I bet you you will leave to see tomorrow. Now we'll get out. Papa, you need to see the way this boy has been disturbing me. Is marriage by force? Olama. If I were you, I will marry him. In Apodala. You are not me. I, I, I am disappointed in you. Look at the kind of man you want to marry your sister. Imagine. No. Eh? Are you the only one who did not circle the mother's belt before she died? Over there now you tell me you saw vision. It's okay. Let him come here again next time. My mother has been pestering my life about taking a wife. Mm, yes, my prince. It's necessary. But I'm not ready yet. And I think I know why. You're still thinking about him, Bozo. My prince. She's dead and gone. And she can never ever come back again. Ezina, those are the saddest words I've ever heard. But it's the truth, my prince. I mean, you need to free yourself from thoughts about Ngozi. You, you need to give in another woman a chance in your life. Prince. Do you think I will ever able to do that? You need to try. You need to. So tell me, did mother suggest anybody for you? I know how mothers can be. Oh, yeah, yes. She, she suggested uh, Olama to me. She said Olama is a very beautiful girl and that she is from a very respectable home. But to tell you the truth, I don't have a short of feeling for her. Good! Oh, that's, please, my, my, my prince, don't have any feeling for her. Pico, eh? that stupid girl. Please, there's nothing respectable about her, her, her family. Don't mind that idiotic girl and her, and her evil father. Pico, Pico. Do you suspect her father will be, might be evil? Yeah, oh. My prince. I don't know the years, Pico. The man is not only greedy, he's ambitious. Everybody knows him for this, in this kingdom. Honestly. Don't even go. I heard he has even um, he has pushed the girl now to come and be contesting for priestess. Really? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so, so what now? What now happens to you, Alova? My prince, eh? Huh? That girl. I in fact, you know, I was trying to <laughs> fool her at that time, but not anymore. She's very stupid. Yeah? She's so full of herself. I don't even know why why I even started liking her. It's not like I eh? like her too much like that too. Eh? <laughs> <Amina. Zinna. laughs> oh. My brother. <laughs> it's not a laughing matter. I don't like the way you're laughing over this. Thank you very <laughs> But you can dance too. Ah uh ah, -uh, Ujumwa, you've started. Why do you like praising me? Don't make me shy that day. Oh. But you know you're still the best. Oh. You can dance too, man. Anyways, um, do you have any special, you know, any special thing to do on that day? That's what I do sometimes. Like any skills, anything, anything special you really need to. <laughs> See, no, not in my day. Oh. This is no more rehearsal now. Oh, okay. Anyway, as for me, Sha, me, I'll just, you know, practice and join the girls on that day. But I already know you are the chosen one. <laughs> <laughs>
Oh, they won't kill me. Mm. So you can't wait to be the friend of this person. Who does he want to be? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh. Hey, see, I want to see. Yeah, okay. Mama. Amarachi. 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 You're sleeping. Amarachi is just a few days from the dancing competition in Oleba and Alarula instead of practicing. Mama, I'm tired. I don't have any strength. You're tired. You don't have any strength. You cannot wait to listen to yourself. Amarachi, get up. Let us practice, please. Stop saying things like that. Mama. I'm not sure to see where all the girls in Obako Kingdom are doing now. Amarachi, you have a mission. Your mission is to save the innocent people of Obako Kingdom. So you need to practice. Is it by snuffing life off me that I, that, that I will do that? Is it by snuffing life off me? You're always complaining instead of practicing. Eh? Nene, your belly woman, look at me. An old woman. And I'm also blind, yet I can still dance. Away for Obelan Wadikai, a young girl like you, with her waist still strong and everything, you don't want to practice. Let me teach you this dance steps, eh? Mama, the one that paints me most is the way she pretends like her father never got her any charm. <laughs> ah! No, no. But I told you she would pretend. Ah. Did you ask her? Eh, uh, not directly. But Mama, as a friend at least, somebody that supports her, she should have said something close to that, Mama. She did not even say, Ben, not even a word. That is woman being for you. <laughs> even when you are sincere to them. Do we still have a secret plan? Mm -mm. mm -mm. I feel so betrayed right now. Mama, I feel very bad. See, I almost confronted her. Ah. Ah. I wanted to meet her. <laughs> but I remember what you said. I said, mm -mm. let me just let me just relax. My dear, it is better you don't confront. So she don't start <laughs> Start suspecting you know of her plans. You understand? I went to Amododo today. And I got more powerful charm. We are going to use that one and beat her to her game. <laughs> me. Mama, thank you so much. In fact, I am so proud to have you as my mother. You know, your wisdom is worthy. <sighs> but I cannot stand and watch this golden opportunity slip through my hands. Okay. Tomorrow, you will emerge the new priestess of this land. <laughs> Yes, like it or not. Yes, so <laughs> here comes the priestess. You're there already, my daughter. Papa, are you sure this will work? As long as the sun will continue to give way for the night, it will surely work. I have the backing of Onawolo, who you know is a powerful medicine man. <laughs> yes, Papa, he told me. And I hope you did not tell that your friend Ujungwa. No. <laughs> Good. I'm sure her mother will give her something. I know her to be so very ambitious, but nothing she gives to her daughter will be as strong as what you have on your waist. So, my dear daughter, run along now and make me proud. Thank you very much. <laughs> but you're not going with me. Uh, no, I have to stay back here and ensure that everything goes smoothly, as instructed by Honor As long as this fire continues to burn, success is yours. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, but I'm coming. Good news. I'm coming with good news, Papa. Why are you stopping? 
Ma. I just remembered how those people banished us from their land. And here we are, going to see if we can save them. We have discussed this thing before. And I told you, you don't pay evil with evil. Vengeance is for the goddess. Mama, how are you sure that those people will not throw us out? How? How are you sure? We're just risking our lives for them. My daughter, we cannot live like this forever. There must be a reason for the dancing competition. And I am sure the goddess knows it. I'm not we, we just have to take our chances. Mama, I'm, I'm not comfortable with this at all. I'm not comfortable. Well, Amarachi, let us go there and see things for ourselves. The goddess cannot keep quiet for too long. Because mom. Eh? Hi, Gaba. What do you want? Who are you talking to, Amarachi? Who are you talking to? Those boys? What do you people want? Leave us alone. Leave my daughter alone. Leave you alone? Your daughter insulted us. Please. And she must pay. Papa, leave her because just take me and leave my daughter. Amarachi. Step any further and kill my rock. Rock? Did you just say you're rough? That thing you think you have is what they call charm. This is a Zibo charm. Give it and up. today, you will so beg for your life because after dealing with you, if. Hey! Oh, give me! Famu got dead! dead? I'm a rich dead! dead? No, Mama, I'm told you never. I'm a rich. Let's go. I'm a rich. Why did you do it? Is that part of the, the, the magic? Come on. Can I? I will come out with a very warm smile like this and look straight into the prince's eyes. <laughs> then after that, I'll just turn my back like this and shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake, it, shake. Wine, wine, uh, wine, okay, wine, 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 I know you will make me very proud today. Eh? Look, and the, 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 the Obaku kingdom will be blessed with a new priestess. And her name is... Uh, priestess Olamwa! <laughs> I'm so proud of you. I am hmm? so excited. Good. Papa, but I'll miss you and I when I become the priestess of this kingdom. Uh, who said that um, the, the priestess is bad from seeing her people? Myself and uh, Ekene will always come and visit you at the shrine. Isn't it, Ekene? Papa, please, let's hurry. I'm sure by now the village square is filled with people. Whatever happens today determines the fate of this kingdom. You've not told me of any vision lately. Uh, don't you see your sister seated on the exalted seat of priesthood? Did you see anything? Mm, Papa, mm. the charm. Oh, yes. Uh, I, I'll, I'll look for it. Um, you see, this is it. You see, it looks like ordinary beads, but they are not. They are very powerful charm. Hmm? They are your sure way of getting to the throne. I pray it works. Oh, it will work. Don't you trust your father? I trust you. Oh, my dear, that's it. Um, um, Papa, let's go. We'll be late. Yeah, I am. I am. Are you, uh, are you ready? No, I want to change to more beautiful dress. <laughs> so I can look more beautiful aye, and attractive. Aye, 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 aye. <laughs> I'm coming. Good. <laughs> That's my daughter. I thank the goddess for giving me such a beautiful girl. Come, I, I, can I, where are you going to? Papa, I thought we were going to the village square. Uh, we are going to the village square, but she's going to get dressed. here today as brothers and sisters to secure a future for ourselves once again. A future that was denied us as a punishment for the sins committed by the late king and the priestess. We were fortunate to have consulted with the priestess of Ideago Kingdom. Who is presently with us here today? She communed with the goddess on behalf of us. We prefer the solution to our problems. 
And that is the reason we are here today. As you all have been told, the anger of the goddess can only be pacified with the gracious dance steps of the best dancer, which will cause her to send down rain on our land once again. Hmm. Gracious dance steps. And the best dancer will become the priestess. And so, let the dance begin. Stuku keri ebe ke ugo, ewe ke ugo, oyata. Abo ha yi mewere, hoko na chuku kade na ka. Shakra yi wai! Une muro teje. Ewa Has gone out. Hey! Hey, Oh, no, Wolo. Oh, no, Wolo. Oh, my God. 
To ruin our land again? I would never cost this land any havoc. I and my daughter were falsely accused and banished. But the goddess kept us alive. You liar! You are a liar and you must leave this land now! Leave! I never wanted to step my foot in this land again. Yes. My mother was the one who convinced me to come and try. But if we must leave, I want you all to know Tell what me. I saw. And what did you see? Tell them. I saw the king and the princess committing the abomination. Hey! Yes. And they caught me watching. Yes. And that was the reason they banished my mother and I. They were committing an abomination. They were. No. <coughs> it's a lie. It's a lie. Both of you are liars. Who sought for for pardon and never got? Now leave. Don't you forget that I am still a queen in this kingdom, and I am still the prince of this kingdom. Yes. Therefore, she must dance. <laughs> Step forward, my daughter. Come and show us what you've got. Let the dance continue. <laughs>
Ochi, please, on behalf of my family and the people of this land, I'm apologizing to you for banishing you unjustly from this land. You see, we were deceived. We are so sorry. Please, I ask you and your daughter to return back to this land. You know As a man, thank you. I thank the goddess and our ancestors for keeping us, for exonerating my daughter and I. Please forgive us. Peace has returned to our land. And you made that possible. We will prepare a wonderful place for you to stay. My prince. Thank you. As a one, you have always been there for us. Thank you. Thank you. May the goddess bless you. You don't need to thank us. We owe you our lives. Long live the priestess of Ogidi. I thank you all for accepting my mother and I once again. And I assure you that I will restore peace and justice once again in the shrine. The goddess is with us. Yes. <laughs> you have to stop crying. You should be happy for me. Now at least I have my legs back. All thanks to the goddess who made it possible to Amarachi. Adam, you are still crying. Huh? You, can't, you can't continue like this. I thought we agreed that... Papa, let me be. Let me be. Okay. Look, my daughter, I brought you this herbs to restore your strength. I don't to... want. You cost it all. Look, my daughter, being hostile to your father is not the way. It's not the best. You cost it all. How? Look, you, I, I did my best. Do, do, do you know how much I paid for those charms? With the nonsense charm you got. Look, look, look don't call our all those charms nonsense. The efficacy of those charms can... I don't care to how with that nonsense charm. It has no juice of efficacy. I shouldn't have listened to you at all. I should have stick to my position. No, no. Look, my, 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 my daughter, there is still plenty of time for you to do that. Eh? There is still plenty of time for you to do that. Just leave me alone. Okay. I don't want to hear, I don't want to hear anything. Just let me be, let me be. Now, where are you going that side now? I said it. I said it, but nobody listened to it, Kine. That's happened. <laughs> Yeah, thank you. you have blamed me enough for this. As if I wasn't trying to help. Oh, you were trying to help. Yes, help me indeed. There has your help gotten me. Oh, you Kiru, how was I to know that the charm will not work? Papa, you, you, Papa, you that boosted to me the amount you made that you have charms for everything on earth. Everything in this life you have charms. Just small charm. Small one for your daughter, me, Kiru, to me. If this is from one, one, one small eternity, from nowhere came with a blind mother, a woman that said you gave her daughter the strongest charm and won. Papa, I am disappointed. Uh, at least you should take solace in the fact that none of your friends made it to that position. You want me to come home to be listening as a failure? I should be a happy failure, me, in Kiru. Papa, do you know how I boasted to my friends? How I told my friends, my friends, that I will be the next princess of Ogiji and I will forever in my life. It's okay now. Shame you. It's okay. But it is not okay. It is not okay. Stop telling me it is okay. What is okay that I failed? It's enough. Uh, don't get so unreasonable. You know how hard I labored to get that charm for you. you. You should be blaming that girl that appeared from nowhere with her blind mother uh, and took what is rightfully yours. Not me. I'll get it. I'll see those gone. I'll call you quickly. Enough! <laughs> What are you doing with the ring? You're still thinking about what happened. 
Mama, why won't I be angry? Why? He promised me. He gave me his word. He said success will become yours. Mama, I was hopeful as well. It's not just you. I thought I would win. Even your friend. Even your friend did not win. He duped us. Mama will not dupe us. After collecting a lot of coins from me, he duped us. Ah, Mama. But the goddess is so mean and unfair. Upon all the pretty girls and body girls that came for the competition. It was an outcast that she favored. Can you imagine? This is no matter of favor. Hm. It's no matter of luck at all. I know Ugochi is going to see a powerful Divya, a powerful medicine man that gave her the charm that helped her daughter. Because she knows that's the only way she can return back to this land. Hm. Eh? If I knew, if I knew, I wouldn't have depend on honor while alone. It's okay. Mm? It has happened. I cannot depend on that right now. I have to move on with my life. And how is your friend? Who is my friend? Thank you. Mama, stop calling Inkiru my friend. Inkiru is not my friend. Though. She's not my friend. What does Inkiru know about friendship? In fact, right now, I hate that girl with a passion. I thought she's your friend. She's not my friend, Mama. Let's go inside. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, <coughs> let's go. Oh, here you are, son. I've been looking for you. <laughs> I've been looking for you. Have you eaten? Yes, mother. You look quite pensive. Am I? Oh, sure. But it's so obvious. But I think I know why. Tomorrow is a special day in your life. The day you will ascend fat ancestral throne as a king. I've been worried over what the future holds for me. I mean, how to rule my people. You don't have to be worried, son. I know the goddess will give you the strength and the wisdom to rule your people. They won't be disappointed in you. Each time I take a look at the throne, I see figments of father sitting there and passing wicked judgments on the people. Son. Promise me you will do no such thing when you ascend the throne. Mama, was it clever for me all the time? You taught me everything I know, even as a blind woman. My daughter Amaraji, I will always and I will keep clapping for you. Mm -hmm. Eh? What can I say? Through you, the goddess gave me back my sight. So my daughter, I will continue to clap for you, as long as you keep dancing. I'm so grateful to you. You inspired me with your great wisdom. And I'm so happy that I listened to your play. I love you. I love you too, my daughter. I love you. Look at you. I am so glad that the goddess kept me to see you grow into a great woman. <laughs> mm, Mama, yes. so tell me, how is your new home? Oh, Marachi, my new home is beautiful. You should see it. I have a compound to myself. And I have Ukwudala in my compound. <laughs> When next I'm coming, I'm going to get you some more. Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> okay. Who would have told me that a widow like me would have such a beautiful home? Mm. Oh, Mama. 
the goddess are merciful. Mama, you're going to teach me some dance styles today. You know I have nothing else to live for. I not to dance with my great goddess. Imaron's mom. Eh? I will teach you. Mm. When? No, what are we waiting for? Ask it. <laughs> Mama, dance! Dance, Mama! Dance! as the king of our kingdom. You have been avoiding me. No, my king. It's, it's actually an act of respect. Since your status has been elevated, I'm overwhelmed. The status my foot. Isn't that? My king, you are my best friend. And I need you more than ever. I have been so lonely. All I do is hold meetings with the elders of this village. And the moment the meeting is finished, they disperse. And I become lonely again. Hmm? I only have my mother to talk to. I'm so very sorry, Your Highness. I only thought you would be too busy for me. Oh, come on, Wokim. I cannot be too busy for my friend. You mean a lot to me. Thank you so much. I can't afford to miss you. So, how have you been handling the affairs of Obaku community? It has not been easy. There are lots, lots of family disputes. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you. In fact, I have come to realize that kingship is not a thing for kids mm. or for the shallow minded. It requires a lot of wisdom. Akonuche. I am telling you. Mm. Mm -hmm. But I thank the goddess for assisting me and enabling me to solve some so far. That's very good, Your Highness. That's very good. Guess what? What, Your Highness? I miss fishing. <laughs> <laughs> I miss all the fun we used to have in the river. Okay, <laughs> okay. I'm telling you. That's now my mother would not allow me to do anything. She tells me I am now okay. <laughs> but is it true? You are my king. So you are supporting her now? Yes, I am. I can. <laughs> I don't mean it that way. But you know. Hola. Hola. I don't need you here. I don't need that your rubbish talk right now. Leave. Hola, why do you hate me so much? I am your brother. I doubt if you're one because you don't wish me well. You detest me so much and you don't like anything I do. Now why will you say a thing like that? I want the best for you. You're my only sister. It's just that you don't listen to me. Papa is misleading you just... Shut up your mouth. Papa has not done anything wrong. All he has been doing is for my own good. But you, you've never wished me well. Lama, that's so harsh and unfair to say to your own brother. You know, if I had seen a future with you and the prince, I would have told you so. But I did not. The same thing happened when you wanted to become the priestess. So what do you want me to do since I can't get all I desire for? Fold my hands? Mbano. I advised you to go for a zina. But you... Shut up! Shut up your mouth! Go for who? Don't even say that to me again. Now leave my sight. Hola. Get out! Hola. Don't come close to me. Don't even say a word again. Leave! Leave! Oh, 
how are you? <laughs> I've decided to come to your house to see you now, since you've decided not to see me after the competition. Mm -hmm. I've been busy. Ah, uh, ah, uh, would you? Too busy to see a friend. Who is the friend? I don't understand. How will you understand? How? Do you know you don't have sense? Yeah. Do you know? You are the biggest fool I've ever seen. Thank you, you are a betrayer. Oh, you think I don't know you have the backing of your father's charm, right? You think I don't know? To think I've been supporting you, you do this idiot, all this while, you didn't even give me any clue. What do you take me for? A fool. And a fool you will forever remain. <laughs> See who is talking. You think I don't know that your mother went to honor our lost shrine to, to, get, to get charms. <laughs> You're not the only one that has eyes for betrayers. I do too. And I'm very, very happy none of us won the competition. <laughs> You know what? You will never be my friend again. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Chelu, 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 Pico. And who wants to be friend with a pig? Who, who? Me. <laughs> Me and Kiru. What did you just say? A pig, how would you prevent it? Okay, 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 okay. Now! Hey, let me help! Pick it out! 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 I'll kill you! Oh! 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 Get out! Get out! Get out! I saw Ngozi. I was playing with her around the forest. And suddenly, she fell into a pit. And I grabbed her hand. I couldn't hold on. Which is okay. Please. It's not your fault that she died. Stop blaming yourself for her death. Biko. I should have been there early enough. Mother, my joy of sitting on this throne as a king would have been complete with her seated beside me. You see? That's why I said, get yourself a woman. Get another woman for yourself. You cannot mourn Ngozi forever. It's not possible. You need a wife. A companion that will be there with you at all times. I mean, somebody you can share your feelings with. Biko. Mother, it's not that easy. Yes. I know, but life will be easier if you get a wife. Hmm? It's okay. You said she attacked you on your way back home. Yes, Papa. Papa, you need to see. She was beating me, giving me grass to eat as if I was a wowser. My whole body is spinning me. Hey. Sorry, Papa. Ma Papa, now. Sorry. But how did she get to know? Same question I'm asking myself. How did she get to know? Because me, I did not tell her anything. Papa, are you sure her mother did not see you on your way to honor our lost shrine? Uh, uh, no. Yeah. I... I I was not followed there by anyone. I went all alone. So who told her? How did, how, how did she know about it? She was so full of herself. She said she knew all this why, but pretended not to. In defense, I had to tell her I knew hers too. Me, I don't know anything, no. Okay. And that is... Her mother must have given her some charms too. Yes! Oh, if she saw me at Ono Awolo Shrine, that means she went there for the same purpose as well. Uh, that woman is evil. But Papa, I thought the goddess would favor me. Hmm, don't worry. Uh, let the girl that took the post, let her take the post and die there as a priestess. But we didn't know that she was going to appear from anywhere. We did not. Uh, now, what I want you to do is to focus on the future. Future? <laughs> what future, Papa? Don't worry. Your Highness, you have restored our hopes and the leadership of this kingdom and have alleviated the sufferings of our people. We are indeed grateful to you and to the Goddess. Yes, my King. The the goddess has showed compassion on our people mm. through you. We are grateful to have you as our king. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Elders of our land, thank you very much. In fact, I'm short of words. You see, initially it was so difficult. I had doubts. But now, all doubts are gone. 
having heard these remarks. <laughs> Your Highness, you are indeed a true king. Mm. You need to see how excited the people are, mm. are how happy they are, yes. and grateful that uh, since you ascended the throne, mm. you have shown that you are the exact opposite of your late father. <laughs> The grace of the goddess is indeed upon you. Mm. <laughs> I thank you all for honoring me this way. And I promise I will keep doing my best. And so, my king, the elders have been talking recently about the future of this throne. Mm. Our people used to say that a man cannot survive alone. The same goes for a king. You need a woman beside you. Who will help you in overseeing the affairs of this kingdom? Have I spoken your minds, my elder? You are well, well spoken. You are in order. Well spoken. Mm. Oh yes, you're right. <clears throat> in fact, I've been thinking towards this lately. You all know how I lost the woman of my heart recently during the disaster that took place in our land. Finding a replacement is something I don't know how to go about. Well, uh, my king, I think uh, I understand how you feel. But uh, what about organizing a, you know, a contest amongst mm. the most beautiful guests in the kingdom mm. so that you can choose from there? Oh, dear. True talk. Mm -hmm. Good suggestion. Mm. 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 That should be the <laughs> <laughs> ah, Papa, you're back. Yes. You're welcome. Mm, you're sitting all alone. <laughs> you're welcome. Yes. Thank you, my dear. You know what? Yes, the prince has finally decided to pick a wife. Are you serious? This is the time for you to catch Uchenna. Uchenna is now finally yours. So, are you suggesting I continue with him? Oh, yes! You know, you, I mean, you, you, you've been there for him all along. And I know that the gods will not disappoint you this time. The goddess owes me greatness. I pray they don't disappoint me this time around. No, oh, they will not. They will not. You've been there for Uchen all this while. You understand? Even though he said there's going to be a competition between you and other girls. But I know deep down in my mind that you are the perfect consideration for him. So I have to start visiting the palace again. Uzibu, uzibu. <laughs> so, you are, you are, why don't you advise other man to do something useful with her life? and give it her false hope all the time. How dare you suggest that I'm giving her false hopes? I remember you assured her that she would become the priestess. But that failed. It is your wicked thoughts and wishes that brought me bad luck. I will not have you interfere with anything that concerns me again. Stay away from me! You know I see lots of issues. You're pushing this girl to the wrong direction. And I don't want her getting hurt always. I have never seen a brother who does not wish his sister well. You are the first that I'm seeing. All my efforts at making this family great and famous you've been against. I want you to go back to that your vision and turn things around in your sister's favor. Or I will disown you as my son. I don't know if you are a witch or a human being. Love you so much. I want him to love me so much, but I hope what you added will not hurt him. So I'll be the one to give you something that will hurt the man that wants to marry you. All we have to do is pray he eats it. Um, alone. Ah, do you want him to eat with his mother? If the mother joins him in eating it, no problem. Or don't you deserve uh, his mother's love? Mama, 
I deserve the family love. <laughs> <laughs> Mama, but if this thing works, hey! Mama, I will appreciate. In fact, what I will do for you, eh? you will not believe this. Just start doing it now because I'm already dreaming seeing you becoming the queen of this kingdom. And I am already acting because I am already the queen of this kingdom. <laughs> That's nice. That's nice. <laughs> <laughs> Mama, let start going. Uh, start going. Go, go, go. So that you come back and bring good news to me. I'm expecting good news. Good luck. In the land of Obaruku, we have great men and we have a great women too. You're welcome to my palace. We have a great future. Please have your seat. Thank you, my king. So what can I do for you? Um, my king, you know since you became king, I've not come to say congratulations. Thank you very much. And um, also, I came to tell you thank you for all the good things you've been doing for my people. And um, I went to the market. I prepared this delicious meal. This is the food. I said, this is for my king. <laughs> That's very kind of you. But you shouldn't have bothered. I mean, you shouldn't have bothered to bring food to me. Since I have it all in the palace and I have enough maidens to prepare them for me. Um, my king, I'm sorry, I didn't know it was too big, so I... What I'm trying to say is that you shouldn't have brought anything since I have it all in my palace. I'm sorry, my king. Um, I can see you are so impressed. Oh, yes, I know. I know. Um, my king, I want you to consider me. I will not disappoint you. In a few days from now, I'm going to announce who, who is fixed for that position. My king, that's why I came. I know you will consider me. I beg of you, please. Please, my king. Hold on. You came to my palace to buy my love with a plate of food? It's obvious that's what you came to do. I just told you I will announce who will fill that position. Are you still here preaching and talking about your love for me? Now you get out! I am done with this conversation. So you may be I will have my guards throw you out after several punishments if you don't leave here now. Out! I co come back here. Now take your place. Take your place with you and leave! So you leave now! Because you're standing in my way. Hola, must you always frown at me anytime you see me? Eh? You know I'm harmless. I'm only trying to defend you. I don't need your friendship. Why? Eh? Because you still love the king. You know he will never choose you. Is that your wish? You've tried several and you have failed. So what does he want me to say? As a prince, yes. But as a king, I stand a greater chance of 
being chosen by him in few days' time. So save yourself your wishful thinking. Now listen to me, you fool. You, if I don't have you in this, in this, in this community, nobody will. Take what? it from me. Get what? Yama, what did you just you say? You heard me, oh. I said if I can't have you, nobody will have you in this kingdom. Get here, yeah. I can't have because yes. Rubbish. Get here, get here, All by force. All by force. All by force. Yeah. Because I love you. Oh, 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 are you talking of Ezina, the son of, of, uh, of Oji? Yes, Papa. The king's friend. He, that the boy one that has been disturbing me. He has now? So he has such gods? I don't know where he borrowed it from. Imagine him telling me to my face that if he doesn't have me, no man will. That he will make sure the king doesn't consider me. Yazina has the guts to warn the daughter of Odense. Well... Hey, Papa, you have to talk to him. I don't know where that threat was coming from. I, Odense, Nobody will stop me from getting the king. I can't talk to him. I have warned him before. Since he doesn't want to let go of you, he will get what he's asking for. That boy is finished. When I say if the boy is dead, he's gone. Papa, are you talking about killing him? Nobody threatens, nobody wants the daughter of Odessa and go scot free. You understand? He does not do that. I see when I say the boy is gone, he's gone, he's finished. Go and get my snuff. Go and get my stuff and leave, leave a zina for me. Eh? Just concentrate on getting the king. That's all you're going to do for me. Leave that boy for me. I'll go to show him. Go and get my snuff. Thank you, Papa. Ha! Uh, little boy. Papa, I'm not interested. My daughter, this is a golden opportunity. The same golden opportunity being a priestess was. Oh no. At least this is a better one. Being a king's wife is a chance that every girl in town wants to take. I want you to be the one to get that chance. But Papa, the king has never taken interest in me before. How do you anticipate things will ever work between us? We are going to use every means at our disposal to get him. <laughs> but I, mean, I don't want to be disgraced like the other day. Your charms failed. None of the other girls' charms worked anyway. Look, the post was given to somebody we never expected, who appeared from nowhere. Papa, I'm not convinced. I'm still not interested. I'm not interested. Eh, uh, you are not interested. Okay. It might interest you to know that your friend Ujumwa has already visited the palace. Papa, you mean my friend Ujumwa visited the king without telling me? Oh, so you don't know she will be interested? My daughter, let me tell you. Everyone in life who wants to attain greatness must explore every opportunity available. Papa, Papa, then you have to do everything possible so, so I can I can be the queen. <laughs> Don't worry, my daughter. I will make sure that you get married to the king. Eh? Trust me, my daughter. Okay. <laughs> but, but wait, did you see me? Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> Greetings, great priestess of Obidi. Greetings. And what brings you to your abode of our great goddess? I am a seer who reads meaning into most of my dreams. But this particular dream, I can't comprehend. So what do you want of me? I need your help in interpreting this dream. In that dream, I saw myself wandering in a forest, looking for a way out. But this forest is unknown to me and I have never been there before. I don't know why I keep having that same dream. Stretch forth your left palm. That's a new evil forest. That explains to me why the forest is strange. A new forest. Yes. And it's not a dream. 
and salvation. The goddess wants you to go to a near evil forest. There is something there for you to see. But it's an evil forest. How am I supposed to go there? The goddess built this for you. And she will surely protect you as you make your journey. So be brave and carry out your maker's bidding. Thank you. What the priestess of Ogidi. I leave now. Hey, now you dance. I can come give greetings. Save your greetings, Goji. Can boss say Why are you attacking me? I don't want your greetings from now on. So you and your daughter think you have won by becoming the priestess, eh? Well, your charms were more effective, I must admit. But know that I have made a lot of adjustments. Charms? Mama, Charms? Oh. I don't know anything about charms. How else would the goddess have favored your daughter? Your half-caste daughter? You used charms to blindfold, to fool the goddess. I hope you know the consequences of your utterances. Consequences? What consequences are you talking about? Well, you can go ahead and become the priestess. But know that there are positions more honorable than becoming the priestess. And becoming the wife to the king is one of them. Is your daughter contesting? Contesting? She doesn't need to contest. She has won already. At least I have the opportunity of becoming part of the royal house. My daughter is going to get grandchildren for me. Instead of having a daughter who will not get any child in her lifetime. You're a very bitter man. I can't stand here and continue talking to you. It's too late, it's not good. Ezinna Ezinna As you step your foot into this farmland you will not come out alive What do I do now? How can I go on a dangerous forest like Anyewe? What do the goddess want me to do there? Should I tell my father? No, 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 no. He will discourage me from going. No sane man will allow his child embark on such a dangerous mission. I think I should forget about all this. But the, f but the frequency of this dream is getting too much. 
I will have to go and know what the goddess has in stock for me. If I don't make it their life, so be it. Papa, have mm -hmm. you thought of anything yet? No. Well, maybe you should prepare him a delicious food. Delicious food? But Papa, you, you said you saw Ujunwa on her way to the palace. That means she must have prepared something for the king. You are right, you are right. Uh, I think we'll take a different angle. Exactly my thought. What is the different angle that will attract the attention of the king? Oh. When you get close to the mother hen, it automatically gives you access to the chicks. Oh, but are you trying to say I should get close to the queen to get the attention of the king? That is the wisest thing to do. Hmm? Get close to the queen and she'll speak to her son on your behalf. <laughs> Thank you very much, Papa. You are indeed a wise man. <laughs> Thank you, my daughter. Thank you. Mm. Are you sure you did not do anything to upset him? Mama, I didn't do anything to upset him. I presented myself well. I carried myself. Mama, that king, though, he doesn't just like me. He's not interested in me at all. You don't conclude. Maybe he was not in the right. Uh, he was not in his right mood at that minute. You know, kings now nah, their mind is always occupied with the things of the land. Mm. <laughs> eh, Mama, but he shouldn't have sent me out to such hostility. See the way he <sighs> sent me out. We are going to look for another way of approaching him. You can't just give up on your man, Mama. I can't it's give up. Yours. I know. I know, Mama. Mama, you have to help me. There's no time again. Me, I want to be the queen. Oh. I want to be the queen. Mama, there's no time. Because, oh. That will surely happen. What happened the last time will not happen again, okay? Yes, ma What is rightfully yours is yours. Nobody can take it from you. Yes. yes. Did he tell you where he was going to? I was sleeping when he left. He didn't say anything to me. Why is the Kenan making things difficult for me in life? If I, if I wasn't present when your mother gave back to him, I would have sworn he's not my son. Why did the goddess give me a son who never sees anything good in what you do in this family? As if he's not part of us. We have, we have to look for him. Yes, but where do we go to? Have you checked with his friend uh, Chede? Yes, he said he hasn't seen him since morning. Anyway, I know he will come back. Let us not worry too much. Are you sure? What do you want me to say? Eh? If he can leave the house without telling either you or me, then it means he doesn't want us to know. He will come back. So we should forget about him. 
Yes, at least for now. Let's forget about him and concentrate on the competition that is coming up in three days. Eh? But I have taken care of your major obstacle. Huh? Yes. Now, go inside eh? and uh, get me back. I'm sorry if I if I disturbed your sleep. No, 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 no. I have had enough sleep. Seems the maidens have gone to fetch water. What can I do for you? My queen, I would love to wash your feet this morning. How? How thoughtful of you. Oh, thank you. But you don't have to bother yourself. I'm sure the maidens will come back and do their work. Please permit me, my queen. I insist. It will be my pleasure. Will you find honor in doing it? Yes, my queen. Okay. Let's go ahead. It's two days now. Nobody has seen or heard from him. And you're not doing anything about it. Why are you not worried? Why are you not looking for him? Why are you acting as if he's not your son? He's your son, Papa. He's your only son. Why are you not worried? I never said I'm not worried. I'm worried, but I'm more interested in making you the king's wife. That is the most important thing for now. Fine. I appreciate your effort. I appreciate it so much. But the truth is, I want my brother back. Yes. Though we have our differences, but he's still my brother. Can you alert the villagers about his disappearance so they can help look for him? I will do that. I will do that. But first of all, let us get the king. Hmm? Your brother is safe. Trust me. Why are you sounding so sure when you're not? Papa, you're not sure! My dear, trust me when I say that I won't allow any harm to come upon any of my children. Your brother is safe and he will soon come back. Believe me. I just, I just hope so. Azumba, Ushi, come Azumba, Awako, Azumba, Iko, Azumba, Iguara, Oh, in the land of Awako. We have a great king and a beautiful queen beside him. Oh, oh. <laughs> and we have the brilliant elders of the rock and the great priest. Goddess of my ancestors, it's two days now and I have been wandering in this forest. Show me a sign. Point me to the right direction, for I am weary and my throat is dying of thirst. Please.
around the way. Great priestess of our land. To what do I owe this unannounced visit? There is a situation that demands your notice and that of your cabinet members. Go ahead. Somebody brought in a powerful charm from Abalaka Shrine. And you know that Abalaka is a god of thunder. And someone from this village dared to cross over to consult his shrine. This is hard to believe. Who would have such metal to dine with a vicious deity like Agbalaka? Who would do that? I, I wonder myself. Huh? Some people can be mean and dangerous. Yes. Huh? Great one, please. Do you have any idea who this person is? Tell us. Let us know. Of what? Of what? I hope all is well. Sit down, sit down. Sit down. All is not well. Sit down. Ofo Why are you crying like a baby? Dead. Oh, he's dead! Yeah. Your Highness, my son is dead! What? What happened? I don't know. I don't know. His body was found near my farmland. Your Highness, Mama Wubo! Hi! Your friend is dead! What is this kingdom turning into? Hi! Oh, it's okay. Calm down. Listen. Calm down! Calm down! But what kind of death is this? Hi! You, you mean... My friend is dead? It, it's impossible! But he's lying. His body lies now. Lifeless in my house. Hmm. Great one. Promise me whoever did this will not go unpunished. I can assure you that, Your Highness. Whoever did this will not go unpunished. So let us focus on the forthcoming ceremony. And after that, we will know who it is. I heard what happened and I remembered how close you were to Izinna, so I decided to come and come straight with you. Thank you. Uh, I, I know his death pained you so much. Same with me, because I remember the way he used to follow me around, begging me to become his wife. Uh, it's a pity he died this way. He was a peaceful young man who was always cheerful. I still wonder why anybody would want to take his life. Enemies everywhere. Life is really unfair. I'm sorry, my king. Thank you. You may leave now. My king, please. I want to use this opportunity to ask for forgiveness. If there's anything I've done wrong to you, please forgive me. Please. Please. Olama, you have no reason to apologize to me, for you've done me no wrong. Get up. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. I can stay and, and, and keep you company. You seem so lonely. Thank you, but I don't need it. I wish to be alone. My king, I can, I can tell you stories that will cheer you up. I can make you smile. Yes. No! Now you may leave. Leave! <laughs> it's okay, my king. It's okay. Don't be too hard on yourself. I'll check on you. Thank you.
Who are you? No, stop. Don't compose to me. Ngozi, so you are alive. I'll hit you with this. He sent you, right? Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Who? I'll hit you with this thing. I'll hit you. Ngozi, it's I'll me. It's me. I'll hit, I'll hit you. God forbid. You can't die before me, your father. Papa, with the way things are going, it seems he, he has totally lost interest in me. But I thought you want to make up with him. Of course. Did you not hear what I told you? I, I, I went to apologize to him and after everything he accepted. But when I offered to keep him company, he refused and said I should go. I think he doesn't want to see me anymore. Well, but... All the same, that apology will go a long way in putting you in his thought and consideration. I want to marry the king. I want to be his wife. Oh, that, but it's already, it's, it's already certain. What do you go now for? Hmm? So we have nothing to worry about. Just go and get ready to become the king. Are wife. you saying I should go back to the palace? Oh, no. Let him be for now. The selection process is already at hand. You understand? And moreover, I will go to Awalaka to get something to assist us. Whoever stands in your way from becoming the king's wife, I will send thunder to strike that person. So just go and get ready. Thank you. Mm, can I really do anything without you? What can you do without me? I can't. You? <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome. Huh? I can't wait to be the king's wife. Mm. The queen mm. of this kingdom. Mm. <laughs> and me an in-law to the palace. <laughs> he kidnapped me and brought me here unconscious. And by the time I woke up, he had already gone. I tried to escape, but there is no way out. You mean him to pay what you here? Yes! He brought me here. And I've been wandering this forest trying to escape from demons and feeding on locusts. I'm sure by now my mother and my brothers will be looking for me. So you don't know of the tragedy that took place in our kingdom? What tragedy? Never mind. It's a long story. I will tell you on our way home. Let's go. Go where? There is no way out. What do you mean there is no way out? I came here on my own. I, I, I don't blame you since you got your unconscious. Why do you think I've been here since? There is no way out of this place. Don't worry, I will take you home. I thought you perished in the disaster. I'm glad you are alive. And the prince who is now our king will be happy to see you, especially now he is about taking another girl. Obin is now the king. Yes. Everyone has lost hope of seeing you again. Let's go. blind that you cannot see. If it's not me, then it's you. My dear Liz, I heard you're contesting you want to be the queen to you. <laughs> hey! I've suffered. I have really suffered. So, you, you this moron, you this imbecile, you want to contest with normal human beings like me? It's good to dream of. I did not say you should not dream of. Dream big! Would you know you called me a stupid girl? And now you're calling me an imbecile. I don't blame you. It's your father, your mother, your generation, your father, your ass. That are imbecile, not me. I talk the way you are shouting. You should be tearing me like the mad dog that you are. Look at you. See how pathetic you look with this stupid thing. See the rubbish, rotten food that you are. My dear, I cooked something too. I prepared it and carried it to the king. And he accepted cow. Me cow. Would you want me cow? You're pushing me. Would you want me cow? You're pushing me. Me cow. You're a stupid girl. You are the cow. You are the air. 
Fool. Keep shouting. Fool. I will beat you the way I beat you the last time. Try me. Ujua, you cannot. Touch me. Ujua, you cannot. I touch you. I touch you again. Touch me. Ujua, I touch you. Touch me. I around almost in circles I told you there's no way out I came here myself I knew the road I took I think there's something wrong with this forest it's like no one lives here life once they walk in here I've heard so many awful stories about this forest the people who journeyed into this place never mix it ah! I think that explains the story presumably we're going to perish here just like them I was about asking you the same question what do we do I don't want to be that there is no way out. There has to be a way out. After all, the person who brought you here made it out alive. Ndokwe, did you see him recently? Yes. He's living happily with his family. Then how did he get out of here alive? That's why he said, if he can make it out alive, so can we. She's lying! I'm not fair! My queen! On my way to the palace to give you to give you coconuts! This idiot! This fool! Ask me out of the palace! This commoner! This daughter of nobody! Ask me! In out of the palace! I'm trying to kill me if I don't stay away from the queen! Liar! Liar! My queen! This idiot says she will use a juggle for the king! That's <laughs> nobody will come close to the king! Even me that wants to be. Please shut up this minute! Look at the nonsense that is coming out from your mouth! Can you do a massive finger? Tell her. Will you shut up? Hey, now I know the reason for your kindness and frequent visit to this palace. If I ever see both of you in this palace again, you see what I will do to you. <laughs> shut up! If you're so interested in making my son to notice you, then come back here in the next two days. I won't be the one to pick a, a woman for my son. When I look here, but my queen, my frequent visit to the palace has nothing to do with the king. It's it's because of my likeness and, and respect for you that I have decided to always make you happy. It has nothing to do with the king. Which respect and love? Liar! You're a liar! Ooh, everybody knows you. So you're even coming here to do Asgare because of king. Liar! My Would queen! She's not here because of you. It's the king. She wants to snatch my king from me. Will you shut up both of you? Shut Look at the nonsense that are coming from your mouth. Shut, shut up! Now I know why you've been coming to this place. Oh yeah, both of you, get out of here. My get out! Yeah, oh, yeah, look at my come away from here. Can I walk with Oh, in the land of Mawako, we have a great king and a beautiful queen beside him. Where have you been? I was beginning to get worried. My dear, the rains. You know, I had to wait for the rain to subside before coming back. Eh? Eh? It's all right. Did you succeed? Yes, now. Don't you trust your father? Look, I got it too. This one is from Amalaka's shrine. This one from Iwobi shrine. Powerful charms, the way you are looking at them. How did you manage to get to? My dear, we, 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 you know, we had to go to the village square, fully prepared for success. You know, I would rather die than to see you not marrying the king. You won't die, Papa. You won't die. Look, my dear, so on a serious note, I am prepared to give my life if necessary. I thank you so much. Thank you, my thank you so much. I am so proud to have you as a father. Oh, my dear. Look, eh, when I said nothing will, no evil will befall you, I wasn't joking. Eh? I want our family to be remembered for great things, for greatness. Eh? Um, I am worried about Ekene. Why? No, oh, don't worry yourself. Eh? Ekene will be found. He will be found. He will be alright. You understand? Okay. Um, 
I'm hungry. You have any food for me? Yes. Okay. Let me get you your food. It's good. Ah. Amarachi. That man Odunze is an evil man. He is so wicked. Do you know the other day I was coming to the shrine, he attacked me on my way. <laughs> Mama, what do you expect of the, if a man whose daughter was being denied of the chance of becoming a princess is just being jealous? I can't stand that man. And everybody in the village, nobody likes him. They say he's a bad man. I know, Mama. But one thing is certain. No harm will come near you as long as I'm alive. I know. Manawaka, he's so desperate. Mm. He's just too desperate. Do you know that I heard that his daughter is taking part in the dancing competition? She wants to be selected as a, the king's uh, bride. She wants to be the next queen. Then this stupid man has been going around telling people that the king has already selected his daughter as the queen. <laughs> you know no good, Difa. <laughs> Mama, there is no harm in dreaming big. You know. But he should just wait for the king to make his choice, eh? He can't shave a man's hair in his absence. Exactly. <laughs> By the way, Amarachi, mm. have you had something to eat? <laughs> Not yet, Mama. Not yet. You know, since I've, been, I've been very busy since morning performing sacrifices. Since I took up this position, I hardly feel hungry. I just eat because I'm human. If not, I can last for centuries without eating. Mm -mm, I can't allow that. You need to eat something. You can't walk on an empty stomach. I, <laughs> I understand, Mama. But you don't have to stress up yourself preparing food for me every time. You know I'm no longer that little helpless girl you used to know. <laughs> I'm of the goddess now and they do take care of me. Amarachi, mm. whether you're the priestess or not, you are still my daughter. Mm. And it is my duty as a mother to prepare food for you. Just wait. I will quickly rush home and make something for you. I'm <laughs> Okay. No, Papa, that girl has beaten more than she can shoot. Papa, you must end her life immediately. Shh. I don't think that is the best thing to do. Papa, that is the best thing to do. Or are you waiting for her to take the king before, before, you, before you kill her? Listen. Ending her life now will make us look suspicious because of the fight you had with her recently. Oh, Papa, you needed to see what she did to me at the palace. You embarrassed me. You know the Queen Mother that I've labored for all this while asked me not to report to the palace all because of that stupid girl. Eh, yeah, don't worry. Let me assure you, once you become the king's wife, the first thing I'll do is to end Ujuma's life and that of her mother. Eh, take my word. Eh, no problem, Papa. Papa, we need to, see, Papa, we need to hurry up. Oh. We need, we have to be ready because that stupid girl and a useless outcast mother, and they are about to make my life miserable. You have a lion and a go-getter as father. Making you the king's wife is the is one of the least possible things I can do. Listen, as long as a crying child will not sleep until she gets what she yearns for, so shall the king have no rest. Until he makes you his wife. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, Papa. Papa, see, immediately I'm the queen. We will not just kill her. We will punish them. Beat them. Worry not, my dear. Papa, Papa, killing them will be very easy. We kill them, punish mm. them, uh -huh. squeeze them, uh -huh. kill them. Not to die. You won't see her to shreds. See them! <laughs> Papa, 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 How did you do this? Oh, Mama. You have really spent a fortune achieving this. I told you, believe it. I will be the easy. Greatest medicine man among all medicine men. He's him alone has the power to change the future. Mama, you must have really spent a lot to get this. I 
sold all we have. And I even borrowed to make sure I see you become the queen of this kingdom. Thank you so much, Mama. It's okay, my daughter. You're welcome. Mama, thank you. Thank you so much, Mama. Papa, be fast! We have to get there before the square is crowded. I'm almost through. I am. May not see so because there's no time. Hmm? Why? Oh, ah! please, please, I loved you. Please don't kill me. And I still do. Why? You was not my father's idea. What was what the one that killed you? Please, please, please spare my life. Please, 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 please. Don't give me. What is it? What is it? What's wrong with you? Who are you talking to? Isina, he appeared to me. Isina. Isina, why would you kill him? My dear, don't worry. He's only a ghost. He won't do you anything. So why would he appear to me and not you that killed him? Oh, forget about that. Forget about that. I am, don't worry. I am going to get you something that will make, make you forget about him and he'll forget about you. You have to do something very fast. I can't live the rest of my life dealing with a ghost. It's okay. It's okay. I'll hang you. Uh, um, so let, let's go now. Where is your son? I, I, I can't find it. I would not even need it. I have the chance. That's all we need. Let's go. Let's go. Azumba, Ush, Azumba, Obago, Azumba, Biko, Azumba, Ekwara. Oh, in the land of Obago, we have a great king. And a beautiful queen beside him. Oh, oh. And we have the brilliant tenders of the rock. And the great priestess. Oh, I am tired too. But we have to stay alive. What's the point in staying alive? If I had my way, I would kill myself. And I watch the demons devour my flesh. Don't say that. I'm tired. Just keep going. Please. Ogiji! Goddess of my ancestors! You brought me here to save her! Please! Come to our aid! Come to our aid. I think the goddess has answered us. Why do you think? Butterflies. I think they are trying to show us a way out. Let's go. We all know what today is. It's a special day for me. It's a day I will choose whom to spend the rest of my life with. I'm a man with few words. I have seen the beautiful girls you presented before me. I have seen them dance. I have seen them wriggle their waists to the rhythms of the drums. But then, I found it difficult to make a choice. It is this difficulty that has kept us up to this moment. However, there must be a queen. I will now proceed to choose that special person that will sit by my right hand side as the queen 
of this kingdom. Wait! Something is not right. Evil charms pervade this arena and they asked whoever came here to charm, surrender and receive of his mercy, else you'll be disgraced. Wants to be disgraced. Priestess, call out their names. I will not have evil people dwell among us. This has to stop. Evil people amongst us have been exposed. My king, Nico, let us continue with the sele selection. Gods, your highness, take this evil element. Lock them up in the palace. I'll see the two kids tomorrow. All right, your highness. Yes. Priestess, should I continue? No. The sky is still not clear. My king. We don't have all the time in the world. The priestess have done her job. Let us... Yes! And you did not even tell me? It's not important now, he's back. Welcome back, my son. Ungozi. Is this really you?
Ada. Hey! Iwe maru o Oto koko iwe Une ne une 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 ne une une Akwanyi si ne pe o Ogide 